if I've lost you. I am at the store you left me at. Ha. Ah. Yep. Anyway, we can continue now. Yeah. We can continue our new game. Which is a new, new game. Yes. Inside the new game. Here I go, baby. Here you go, killing again. All right, I have to choose a starting deck. And after thoughtful consideration, I have chosen this one. Yep. Special is to replace the scribe Grimora and become the scribe of the dead. I will take this starter deck. Yeah, of course you fucking would. Bones! Okay, so. Such a fucking black. Oh, yeah. alter deck. There we go. Got to drag it to the side. So we have Skeleton. Skeleton. Perishes after attacking. Droga um, can't be sacrificed. When it perishes, the creature inside is released in its place. Okay. Gravedigger. At the end of the owner's turn, Gravedigger will generate a bone. Zombie. It's a zombie. Frankenstein. Cool. Okay. Cool, and I noticed that you've got numbers associated with it at the bottom uh, for how many you've got in your deck. Yes. So two, Frank, two, one. Two, three, five, three, and seven. I wonder why we've got so many skeletons. Skeletons. Can you go off the path? Can I? What is this, he says. Let's see, can I go off the path? He wants to know. And the answer is yes, but it doesn't. Not really, Is there anything yeah. behind the gravestones? I mean, I don't know if they're gravestones, but they feel like gravestones. They are not gravestones. But the answer is yes, it just doesn't do anything. Also, is it just me or is that the same hand we were seeing on the globe? Yes, this is the same as the globe. Let's go interact. Click on him, man. Woof. I was just about to call it quits out here. But now that there's a challenger in our midst, it's back to work for me. Should we be able to get this bridge fixed in? Full disclosure, it'll take me exactly as long as it takes for you to defeat one of those scribes. Oh. So, uh, come back later. I wonder if you can see anything here. Woof, it's hard getting back into the swing of things after a long break. You and me both, buddy. Gotta gather that momentum. Can't sequence break. Alright, so we can go up here or down here? Let's go up here. Hmm. Hey, P3. 273, you say. Okay, 273. Popped in the chat. No. No fish, no purse. Oh, that's the angular. Angular. Does anything happen if you, like, interact with the well? I assume you tried that. You pried the chest open and found a card back inside. You got a booster pack! You received a beastly card pack. Elk form. Oh. Procol. Waterborne. Also, when Procol is played, it provides an energy cell to the owner. It's the rare, apparently, as opposed to the one with gold on it. Warren. Banshee. Banshee will strike an opponent directly, even if there is a creature opposing it. Okay, it's a flyer. Only two bones. A ruby golem can't be sacrificed when ruby golem perishes. A ruby mox is played created in its place. So what are ruby moxes? These cards were added to your collection. Alright, so I can... Also your deck, yeah. Click once and then click over in the spa other space. Okay, so I can... Are these in my deck now? Yeah, Invalid, so. 0 out of 20. Oh, I don't actually have a deck yet. Oh. Well, let's start with everything in the starter deck, shall we? Yep. Yeah. And... Hmm... Let's pop these guys in here just for the hell of it. New Ruby Golem. Huh. The war. I don't know what that cost is, so... Let's not put it in the deck yet, huh? Yeah. I'm sure we'll see it very soon. Oh, this like actually has a more. maximum? Yeah. Well, it's. I'm guessing that's a suggested size. Like, you know, technically you have to spot, have 60 card right. deck in Magic, but, you know... So it hasn't stopped you going over, which I would expect it to do so a bit, so... Yeah. Okay. 
That's prospecting. Dag nabbit! That dang hound got herself lost again! Who's the hound? You think you're getting past? Think again! Not till I get some proof, my girls, alright? Good dog owner. So you reckon that was the hound? He's a good girl, uh, and then she hides really behind the bridge. Good. What about in the well? Can we do anything with the well? No? No. Yeah, Caper Balance is minimum 20 cards. Okay, cool. Also, I'm going to options up speed, my yo. tech speed. Okay. Yeah. Back we go. Stop shaking. The only thing you have to fear is your own inadequacy. Behold me, I am Leshy, the scribe of beasts. We share a desire for you to challenge me, but first... I know what you're thinking. No, this is not my legendary camera. Not the one I use to create beast cards. This one is a mere replica. You may use it to create photos of the beasts in these woods. My subordinates, the prospector, the angler, and the trapper, they each require a photo before they, cons they will consider battle. Return to me when they are all defeated. Okay, anything else to say? Okay. Not much to say. Oh boy, we got more puzzles, Scullipper. Oh yeah. Hey, pull the um. Nope. Uh, so pull that one down. Draw creaked open, and you found a pack inside. I'm betting there's more of those than that. Okay, awesome. we got a bullfrog. We got another hurlcarl. Yeah. We got uh, the adder, another ruby golem, explode bot. When explode bot dies, creature opposing it as well as adjacent friendly creatures are dealt ten damage. That's really a lot of damage. Oh, another card pack. I got Urali. Sorry, Urali. You. Or a Yuli. Emerald marks can't be sacrificed. Emerald marks on the board provides a green gem to its owner. Another explode bot. Okay, so the emerald marks said. <laughs> well, we don't know what these do, so Let's see. Do we want Uriali in there? Seems expensive. He is quite expensive. Bullfrog, maybe. I don't know if Adder needs to go in there. Oh, there's two bullfrogs. And I don't know how to play this, so... Well, I assume that the bot um, uses those new uh, thingamabobs that we found. What do you think of me, Bobs? Uh, so the, um, the, the horror call... Two, uh, 273. You could have gone the other way for that. You take a stinking pile of meat from the safe. <laughs> Fun. Sorry. You wish to trade? You don't perchance have any pelts? No? That is disappointing, but I also accept foils. Oh, you've got a couple of foils. So. Oh, I have no foils. Oh. Ouroboros, squirrel, stoat, I think one, two. Squirrel ball. At the end of the owner's turn, squirrel ball will move in the direction inscribed in the sigil and drop a squirrel in their old space. <laughs> Interesting, but we can't do anything with you yet. Can we interact with any of the drawers or anything? No. Looks like these are just crates. Oh. This is the back room we were in, I guess. Anything over here behind the black? Okay. Well, we got an old pile of meat. We deposit. It's the Poochie! So, oh. Let's see, can I photograph that thing? No. Oh well, we tried. 
Let's talk to this guy, huh? Well, I'll be done. That's my girl. I'll let you pass me and into yonder pond. But dag nabbit, first we've got a battle. God fucking damn it. Oh, it's the prospector. Marvelous, your first battle. Are you surprised to see me here? But you did select my starter deck. In order to play my cards, you will need to collect bones. You gain a bone win. Why do your eyes glaze over, hmm? Marvelous. You already understand. My time as an insect was not a total waste. Okay, cool. Interesting. You also apparently start with power cell. Uh, I do? Uh, I guess I do. Huh? Seems as though I have them. Well, we don't have anything yet. I might as well chuck some things on the board and get going. Uh, how do you propose I do that, Philippa? The, the, they don't, skeletons don't cost anything, do they? Yeah, no. Oh, they don't. Nice. Okay. Can um, they be sacrificed for the rabbit warren? Is the other question. They can, but I got nothing to really defend against, so, you yeah. know. How would I just. Sakio. Oh, when these things attack, they die. Um, yeah. Rockel provides an energy cell. Okay, so we'll just pop you there then. Okay. Never have it down should you want it. Right. I think I'll leave that. Ding. Oh, here comes the bloodhound. Okay, skeleton. Might as well get a use out of it. Even if it dies, it still does its thing. Let's see, let's play to rabbit's wood. Rabbit is fine. Okay, cool. So, um... I guess you're right. Yeah, I don't know what the hammer is for. Yeah. Skeleton collapses into a pile of bones. We now have bones. Okay. Grave digger. He'll, the hound will come down to get that grave digger though. Yeah, and that will give her a call. There we are. Hmm. Damn. You could put it in front of the squirrel. Squirrel and put it in front Sack of the... the rabbit worm? Yeah, sorry, yep. Yeah, you're right. And he can't jump there. There you go. Okay, well, we can just put this guy here to block. I assume it's a 10 to the winner. Yeah. Okay, well, we can't really play anything right now, so... Oh, we won! Yep. Here's fair! You beat me like a dog! Take this! Some say these here cards are better than gold! Gold, I say! Okay. Mole Man. We like the Mole Man. The Walkers. When the Walkers dies, four bones are watered. I feel like that's they a terrible They cost four bones joke. themselves. Yeah. Thick droid. Be thick. Not All really, right. though. Expensive for a dro thick droid. Alright, let's check out this deck, huh? So, now that we know what we're doing a little bit, so unless we have these guys really we don't need Crocal, I think we should take them out. Yeah. But we could have put these explode bots in, they seem useful. They need two and we've only got one when we start. Uh, when we start, yeah, but it just kept upping every turn. Oh, I didn't notice that. Mm. This is purely like a timer thing. Okay, cool. There's Fick Droid, and that has that times five, and it's only one free. So, yeah, maybe we don't bother. You're not um, thick enough. Mole Man, you probably deserve to go in. Now let's take down our, like... We didn't really need the Grave Diggers, did we? We didn't. Um, perhaps we'll take them out for now. Okay. 
And I guess I can keep things like this until I learn a little more. Yep. The way to yonder pond is clear! Okay, cool. Okay, pond, I guess huh? we can get a fish from the pond. That's where we're getting the fish. We now have a charm. the bait bucket. Place the photo on the line, yep. Got a shark. Fun times. I assume we now go show that to the angler. Off to the angler. Fish. Fresh fish. Good. Still must beat. Classy. Interesting. What do we got here? Salmon. Waterborne also moves. Hmm. I'd say just put two skeletons down and then let the frozen skeletons come out and have fun. Yeah. Skeleton collapses into a pile of bones. Okay, so we don't have these guys yet. Yeah. But yeah, just like chuck him. Put one there? Yeah. Oh, it was just another skeleton. Yeah, like, that's what I was expecting from that, and you can totally put him down as soon as you want. Yeah, and when I think I want is later, though. Yeah, let's go. Since it blows up everything adjacent. Like, say, for example, those two sounds are coming in. Okay, um... Let's see, at this stage, maybe we sacrifice you to put down the that. And then we put down you here, I guess? Yes. And the sal salmons are surprisingly strong. I think I made the fish a bit too hardcore. Yeah. All oh, right. I don't have a body to sacrifice yet. Well, I can put these guys down and maybe wait until I get more fodder. Yeah. I mean, I'd almost put it. Yeah. There's the longest time, and it'll do the most damage in the meantime. Oh, I won. Yep. Didn't even need to fuck around. Yep. You reach us first. Take beast pack. <laughs> Ooh, Mantis God. We do like Mantis God. Hover Mage. So it's a flying dude. Takes a sapphire sarcophagus. Grow into a more powerful form after a turn. Interesting. I want to get that one in. Uh, Mantis God is pretty decent as well. Especially if we can upgrade it like we could in the main game. That's a big if, though, unfortunately. Yeah. Those may be only Leshy's thing. Now, let's see. Uh, Mantis God, we want in. And, um, Sarcophagus. Probably actually want to take the bullfrogs out. They're not that good. Yeah. We got better dudes for that. Okay. Me, work, continue. Find fish for Leshy. A bunny. bunny and a trap. I wonder if you can take a photo of the trap. Probably not. No. Patches of dried blood crackled as you pried the chest open, but two packs were inside! We got Mole, we got Hrokal again. Buff Conduit. Other creatures within the circuit completed by Buff Conduit gain a power. <laughs> That's the same as Alpha? We'll find out, huh? Yeah. Uh, field mice. When field mice is played, a copy is created in your hand. Skelamagus. After attacking Skelamagus, perishes. Also, Skelamagus is. If Skelamagus' owner controls no mox cards, Skelamagus perishes. But uh, it is only two bones. Okay. Full power. So that's a good one hit wonder for us at the moment. Yeah. Um, okay. So let's pop some things in the deck. So, 
We want to put in, um, do we want to put anything from here? Just really? bones mint. And we'll oh, check we'll, out those. Yeah. Well, we'll check it out. Okay. Um, and is there anything I don't like in here? Well, we haven't had too much of a time to explore most of these guys. Yeah. So we'll give them their day in the sun. And I think we have to get out of the trap, which is horrifying. Ah, the trap can be moved. That's pretty horrifying. It's a trap. It's a beer trap for a rabbit. The results are not going to be pretty. <laughs> we what might get happens when you catch a beer in there? It's also not pretty. They often die. Sometimes of starvation. God damn you, rabbit. Yeah, go near that hole. It will, I guess, it's basically trying to stay away from so okay. you. Done the sand, yep, there it goes. Oh, and oh. Basically be up the sand between these two warrants. It should go between the other two. So what, like here? Yeah. But you see what I mean, it is at the very least. There you go. There we go. Pelt. Pelt. Oh, Keeper said, maybe place it on a hole. Maybe that would have worked. Maybe. We now have a pelt. Hello. You have brought a pelt. I am pleased. Yet another turn of the skinning knife. It is time to set another trap. <laughs> I smell the hair's blood on you. Well, all right. What are we here? Burrowing trap. Burrowing trap will move to a strike. Move to that space to receive the strike instead. Also, when the burrowing trap perishes, the creature, causing it perishes as well, a pelt is created. <laughs> all right. Well, time to check the skeleton down. It's the only move at the moment. Bones. Okay. Down, we we don't it. have anything, but we can put down the conduit or the exploder. You could put down the exploder because you could get it to take out. Um... Yeah, I think that's wise. Oh. Or a skeleton, which could give you the mantis odd. Um... Which yeah. will also then give you the flyer. Uh, or I could put this here. Yep. Okay, it doesn't seem to be buffing right now. Uh, maybe something needs to be on the other side of it as well. So okay. say complete a circuit. So maybe you need multiples of them? So put the put the skeleton on that side, like if I'm right. Which side? This side yep. or this side? Uh, on the left. Okay. Nope. Okay. nope, not doing it. Do I want to sacrifice him for a Mantis? God. mantis? Yeah, I think so. Maybe sacrifice this for a Mantis God? Yeah, but then it'll be directly in the way of Bullfrog when the Bullfrog comes down. I mean... Not if this gets in the way. Oh, true. But then it goes 1, 2, 3, so... Mm. I think I'll take this out, put this here, see how this goes. Okay, so I've got my flyer available, but it doesn't really do too much. Mm -hmm. all... Alright, I gotta sacrifice something for that. I guess I could sacrifice the flyer. Or I can sacrifice this. Doesn't really yeah, do that much. I think it might be that times. Is that a rabbit? Yep. That's a zero one. Don't really need it just yet. Shit. There goes my mantis. 
Oh, there goes a wolf. There goes all the wolf frogs, though. Oh. What? Only the one in front, it seems. Okay. Don't have enough bones. Oh, I just used up a bunch of bones, yeah. that's why. Uh, I dropped down the rabbit for In front of Cody. Yeah. So now you've got two bones. You also could get the skeleton down, because that could also go in front of the cone. Same reason, because um, that will then get your skeleton, yeah. who will then attack it and kill the coyote. There goes the raven. Two bones for two bones for zombie, zombie or two bones for flyer. Well, oh. doesn't make much difference, does it? No, it doesn't. See. There you go. You've got a bone back at least. Yeah, things are not going the greatest. Skeleton will at least take out the bullfrog. Uh, and we probably just want to pop this here. That at least pulls it a little more in your favour. Uh, uh, I guess we'll pop you here. Yep. Yeah. So you're now doing one more than yeah. it. So. Oh, hey! This one, that can rid us of the raven. Don't have enough bones, of course. Yeah. Skeletons. Skeleton collapses into a pile of bones. Hey, Mr. Skeleton, Skeleton. You could sacrifice um, the frozen skeleton, which will turn into a I can't Marie. sacrifice this one. You can't? Oh, can't, can't be sacrificed. Sacrifice. I see it. Damn. No, I'm afraid the rabbit warren is not what we really want right now. Yeah. There we go. We won anyway. Yeah. The trap is shut, yet the prey escapes. And the trap awaits for the next victim. You've defeated the three of us now. Unless she awaits. Oh, a mole man. And an elk. Um, okay. I grabbed the mole man, that's for sure. Um, so it's, I guess the zombies didn't really do much for us, did they? Um, they did an okay amount. We want to get rid of these ones, right? Yeah, so yeah. I think you want to, yeah. Um, I kind of want to look up how they are meant to work if they don't work like the alpha, because that seems like the what they were supposed to were yeah. indicated as doing, so... Alright, let's try this allotment. Have I got any? No, I have no foils. Just a pelt. Alright, Leshy, let's talk to you, huh? You had bested the unhinged prospector, the gormless angler, the enigmatic trapper. You found yourself standing before your ultimate match, Leshy, scribe of beasts. Steal yourself, for my beasts will show you no mercy, only fangs. <laughs> Do not spare your creatures. My camera is waiting to capture them at the moment of their demise. Yep. And my beasts are famished. Okay, to All right, a cool. skeleton in front of one of, in front of the coyote to get rid of the coyote. Yeah, and then we could just like pop one in front of here, and um, honestly, I could put down Warren um, and then Mole Man. Yeah, because the Warren gives you the rabbit, yeah. so yeah. What pulls out a rabbit? I mean, I don't know if you want the rabbit just here, but yeah, I suppose so. Doesn't hurt. Put down the Mole Man. I'll need a photo of that one's cost. Oh, you're gonna do something funky. Yes, he is, but that costs nothing, so... Elk fawn, huh? Well, that one will kill it before it turns into a thing, so... No, it won't, because I uh, will be striking nothing but ear Oh, first. true, yeah. Hmm. 
one moment before that one dies. I'll need to capture its stats. Oh yeah, zero two. Thanks. Yep. Elkhorn moves to a new space. Okay. Now the Elkhorn will die. Yep. Do I want to hit the stone? I probably I mean, it's don't. gonna die anyway, so might as well hit the stone. And finally, the sigils. <laughs> you are making yourself a real piece of shit, Nicky. <laughs> yeah. do. The depths of your creatures will form a beautiful mosaic. Oh, fuck. Well, That's right, it doesn't hit the elk. It actually just hits the ear. Saved, apparently. Okay, oh, we don't have enough bones yet. Well, fuck. It's fine. Oh man's got us. Oh, oh huh? Man. Well, we can just kill that elk now. Yeah, you will die, but... but for, requires mox cards to exist and therefore dies. Ah, oh, shit. Oh! That happened even... before I got a chance to use it. Damn, I thought that it would at least last the turn. Okay, yeah. Skelemagus, not so cool. Yeah. As we fought. Um, cool, so we'll kill just fuck you here to kill, kill Stoat. Not fun. Oh. oh, I don't have enough bones. That's right, I don't have five yet. Ooh, did I just lose? I did just lose. How utterly disappointing. I was hoping for a greater challenge. It was all over so quickly. Oh, if I could extend the struggle. But the kill is only as satisfying as the struggle that precedes it. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna do some deck building. Yeah. Get rid of those Scalame guys. Yeah, uh, I think he's further. Yeah, there he is. Uh, Sarcophagus. We haven't done. We have never used the Sarcophagus yeah. yet. So the explode bot's kind of less useful knowing it only goes in front. It does only go in front, and it does also kill stuff to the side. Yeah. But it is like basically a free adder. Yeah. Okay, I think we can be better off like this. Yeah. Let's try it again, huh? Yeah. Will you fight harder this time? I crave a true challenge. At least we don't have to fight all our way to the end. Yeah. My camera is poised. Show me something worthwhile. Skeleton to kill coyote. Pulling out a rabbit, and I think that's what we'll do for this turn. The cost. Zero. Okay. Well, you Let's could see. just toss that in front of the bullfrog, it's not like it really matters. I could, I could. And then you could pop the um, flyer down if you wanted to. Yeah, the flyer's gonna be pretty useful. Skeleton collapses into a pile of bones. Next stats. He's gonna end up with just a skeleton. He is at this stage. All we need now is the sigils. Oh, okay, so he gets a rabbit, I guess. Yep. That will do. Allow me a moment to prepare. Okay, here we go. But uh, our actual... Our bones... These guys are not that good. Um, yep. I'm thinking of cutting them out of the deck. <laughs> There we go. Yeah, if only you hadn't taken that uh, thing of me, well, then you could have uh, used it's it. It's fine. This guy's going up against a fly blocker anyway, huh? Yeah. Um. He's not gonna kill anyone. Yeah, he's not gonna he kill anyone. At least get some damage. I'm gonna wait till he can kill the adder. Go. Cool. And there in front of the editor. Uh that dude can block Rock. anyone you anyone want. really. And then get you a And a this one. No, I'm not having a bone. Oh that cost me a bone. Single bone. Oh well. Ok. 
Okay. Only one of them. Surprisingly. Oh, that's got me my bones left. Ugh. I think that's me. Okay, I think those like shitty bone guys are getting out of the deck. Okay. Okay, bone guys. Um We're gonna get rid of all of our bone contingencies, I think. Okay, so Because uh, they're just kind of making the deck back. Right. Uh that's your zombies. So I don't think these drogas are really Hanging out, no, hanging out. Really. I mean, they are only one bone. They're probably okay. Uh, these guys definitely can go. Yeah. So Gothicus, we still haven't seen. So that could well be worth it. Yeah. And then we've got the Warren, which is kind of handy for a sec. Warren's place. pretty decent. It gets extra bones all on its own. And it goes. Let's see, so maybe we need blood. more hardcore beasts. We have been able to get. Some decent amounts of like sacrifices. Pack rat might do us good. That's not the pack rat. That's Sorry, field not mice. Pack rat. Oh, field mice. Yeah. I was thinking maybe the elk instead. Yeah. I don't know if we really still need the grizzly though. Probably, Probably a bit too, too much. So yeah. We um, could add some more um, warrants if we wanted. Oh yeah, we could definitely add some more warrants. Take out some of these. Um. Maybe we'll just take... Oh, we'll take out the Banshees. I don't think the Banshees are worth it. Yeah. And Zombie, I actually don't think you're worth it either. There we go. And then we can take out those Draugas, and we're on a solid 20. Oh, uh, you've got one Draugr left. Yeah, but we're on a solid 20. Yeah. So we don't want to... Well, oh, we could have a look at the other um, card sets. Be like, is there anything from the other sets that we want to draw in? I mean, we don't have much. No, uh... It's Fictroid, but that has to get me to five, and it's only a one free with nothing else. Yeah, so we're not often using um, using its stuff, but what about the mage stuff? Yeah, no. Yeah, like this gets energy, but none of the kinds that we have. Yeah. None of the kinds that, that we want. That at least we have now looked that I'm satisfied we have done our best. Fresh meat for my beasts. <laughs> okay, we've got Mantis God right here. That's useful. Well... Could also chuck a um chuck the bonus in front of his bones. In front of there? Yeah. Um I guess so. Although I'd probably be better off sacrificing it for a warren. Yeah. Oh, but, in that case do we yeah, want to we'll leave, leave it, it for this turn? <laughs> Hello Mulsa. Okay, so we actually have a plan to kill this thing over two turns. Yes, the cost. We haven't actually seen what this is building to yet. Uh, you know what would be super funny? Because the next one that dies here would be like wanting the, um, the, the stats from. Yeah. I was thinking of the warren, so it's got no fucking attack power. Well, it's uh... very close. Oh, got that me. is going to kill our mantis god, though. Yep. Shall we put the um the explodey bot down in the leftmost column? Because that way we've got it attacking. Just, You're right. Yeah. It is better to have it attack. Yeah. Oh, and you're done. You won't be needing those. I have something better. Hmm. We never did finish your death card. There wasn't enough death. I hope you don't mind my filling in the blanks. Damn. Okay, well, I do have a bunch of, like, costless goons. <laughs> goons! Costless goons! Goons. Okay, well, let's see, I guess I'll put in a bit of damage on him. Are 
you start just getting me red warns when they die? Don't think so. Excess damage. Oh, nice. that's how I get foils. Nice. The great Maybe scribe was well. incredibly bested. Far away, a light enveloped a long forgotten monument. Uh, yep, here we go. It's not creepy at all. You had triumphed, narrowly avoiding tooth and claw. The scribe of beasts was defeated. That you were able to defeat me beggars belief. But I must now yield to you. My only regret is that our battle was so brief. Surely the summit of victory is made sweeter by a more arduous ascent. Received a beastly guard pack. Another ball. Practice wizard. Uh... That also doesn't really do <laughs> Make an entire ball of squirrels. <laughs> Ooh, another, another booster. Mole man. Takes... Pay two bonus to increase power and health of Gamage by one. Okay. The scribe of beasts was defeated. Okay. Wonder why it's the battery low. What is that? Looks like weasel. Start. Start. Add to see your face after you, you lost. <laughs> You're just so bad. It's no wonder we're back here again. And we would have been even sooner if the disc wasn't lost. Take a long look at this face, because you'll never see it again. I'm done being your pet, you stinking beasts. It's not very polite. No, but he didn't trap him in the body of a stone in a cloud. Beeper balances Metaton? <laughs> I pushed it too far that last time. Why don't they see? To live as a beast would be the noblest thing. Even so lowly a creature as a stoat. Yeah, showing in the wood is not as good as you think it is. Alright. Well, you said that there would be a bridge and. There is a bridge now. There is a bridge. It's a shining monument. Huh. Do we want to go murder the Crouch Keeper first? I mean, I guess it would make sense. We have the best grasp on her uh, stuff style. Is is he the Liver King? The Liver King. I, I don't follow. So we could get this one. But honestly, uh, a gourmet, I get it. Um, I don't think putting this one in the deck just to get this guy is really that worth yeah, it. Yeah, not so. yet. We don't have enough things to prop together. Let's see if anything here sends me towards the bone style. You're here! It's an internet drama thing. Marvelous, I am Grimora, scribe of the dead. Until quite recently, I was disgraced. Though I was returned to my former glory with the help of some unlikely friends. If you wish to test your skills against me, you must first prove your wits. You must discern which tomb marks the final resting place of my lovely ghouls. As the saying goes, no matter how upset you are, it's not good form to dig up your owner and motorize his corpse. Kind of piece of an epitaph. <laughs> it reads, eaten by a hungry dog. Oh no. Oh no. Do not look upon me. Do not snarl or sniff. I beg you, if you wish to battle. Please, let us get it over with. Alright, I guess I'm fighting this guy. Well, time for skeletons. Yeah, I guess. What have we got here? Bone Hound. Got it. And it's a um, defender. Pull a warrant out of your hat. Alright, we've got defense. Oh, and do we want another bone? Probably not. Ooh, revenant. After attacking, it perishes. Hey, cool. Do we want the fawn down now? Because at we the moment. Definitely it's... do. Because it's going to get murdered by the bone hound. Oh, wait. Yeah, you're right. Ugh. Mm. Damn. Well, let's start remedying that, I guess. I might just be about to die now, though. Yeah. Shit, well, we got unlucky there. Yeah? Yep. Oh dear, does this mean you will try again? 
You searched for the bongs and found a cod pack. Received a deathly cod pack. Ooh. Dead hand. When dead hand is played, discard your hand, then draw a new hand of four cards. Ooh. Fuck yeah, we're taking that. Waterborn ghost. Oh, so at the end of the turn, the ghost ship will move in the direction of the scribe. Gotcha. Alright, we're definitely taking that hand. And can we put the death ship in? That sounds just funny. No, I don't think the death ship is a good investment. Who do we want to take out? Maybe Drogger. this Draugr? Yeah. He just cost us a match, so... Dead, kind of. Okay, so we got this over here. Um... Hark! A living slice of lemon approaches. Bright and triggered lime. You think you will squeeze a defeat out of me? Thanks. Okay, these guys, these guys are willing to fight straight away. Nice. Okay, it's pirate go ship, ship, ghost ship. Oh, we can get a form down. Doesn't seem to have any power for some reason. Yeah, because it just its purpose is dropping skeletons. It drops skeletons? Yeah. It's the ghost ship. Oh, it drops a skeleton in its old place. Yeah. Okay, this thing. We've got to be careful with that because if we put it down in the wrong spot, the skeleton. We'll the put form. it down here for now at least. Yep. Well, you're right. The fact that the elk is like moving around means some problems. Okay. We could put a skeleton in the empty space at the other end if we wanted to, but the, um... To tip the scales, that'd be two, three... Yeah, you're right, that is just a win, isn't it? I think so, yeah. Excess damage! One! Get some foils! Nice. Aye, you beat the pulp out of me! Firstly, to take you this. Card pack. Let's see what cool things we get. Okay, yeah, so we've got ship. the ghost ship again. Uh, Necromancer. Whenever another creature you own dies, it is returned to life and dies again immediately. Ooh, double bones out of our skeletons. It's true. Muscle Mage. At the end of the owner's turn, Muscle Mage will move in the direction inscribed to the sigil. Creatures in the way, we pushed. Okay. I think this rear may well be worth using. Mm-hmm. And because you bested me, with ye, I'll share me secret. Me name's Royal. It's the far right tomb. Here's the headpiece. Got a piece of a headpiece. It uh, reads Royal Dominique, Dominique, Dominique 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 Gears. Gears. Dominique Gears, uh 1589, spring 1652. Like I said, name's Royal. Right, okay. Life didn't give me lemons, so I died. Oh, okay. Scurvy. You died of scurvy. You're not the dog diff. Um, okay, so. Putting the necromancer in there. Cool. Seems like this could well prove broken. That's gonna be fun. Okay, cool. And a piece of an iptar for the caster, among other things. He's hit by a falling piece of ice. Card pack. Why oh, was there a broken obol? Okay. Tomb robber. Pay a bone to create a skeleton in your hand. What does it cost? Uh, Fair? nothing. Looks like it's free. Damn. You fucking I mean, good. it doesn't have any, um, power, so that's the problem with it, but, uh, also... Yeah, I guess it converts bones into sacrifices. Man, that obel is expensive. Yes. Three for four. It does die to four. It does create a death in the meantime. Mm-hmm. All right. If cool. the necromancer is in play, it goes to, um... I'd assume it'd give you five bones then. Alright, let's see if Tomb Rob is any good. Just add it. Straight up add it. We could. I don't know if we need We're as many warrens though. Yeah, probably take out a warren or two. Two it is. That's the back rooms. Ooh, fascinating. Ah. Four? I am different now. You're back. I'm back. Okay. 
So let's see, dead hand. But it costs five to play. Don't want to play it yet anyway. Yep. That might be handy to play against the um against the skeleton there. One that dies, yeah. Well this one's gonna die regardless, so I think we just Well you of... could um oh I just realized, yeah, it's gonna die regardless. You what you could do And he's gonna block it, so yep. And now you can put the explode bot down in front of the one that's gonna be killing lots of things and just yeah. put a skeleton down to murderize things. Because uh, hmm. he will jump to block. Yes. But then he will die. I mean, the biggest problem is the exploder is going to explode. Yeah, that is going to explode my mole man now. That is horrible. Damn. That didn't that wasn't a very good use of an explode bot. No. Nope. Oh, but we can uh, put this guy down now. So when you do, he's gonna jump over, so then you've gotta get a skeleton to pull him away from there, yep. Yeah. Ooh. Nice. Mummy Lord. Mommy Lord. Nice. Yeah, I'd say put him down and have um, him kill that thing. There we go. That's soul set. Interesting. That recharged your charges. You recharged my charges? Yeah. You went back up to five. Up. So oh, five. so they go away? Hmm. Oh, I've only noticed some. them going up. Yeah, you spent some, so... Interesting. It is over. You chewed me out. Now please, look away. Turn your eyes to this card pack instead. Wait, we never beat this guy, did we? No. We lost him the first time. Another tomb robber, but I don't know how good he is. Yeah. Oh, other half of the oval. Oh, yeah. I am called Sawyer. The middle stone marks my grave. Please, do not go digging up my bones. Sawyer, okay. I wonder if I should write down when they died. Do not hold a grudge. Oh, there was another piece of epitaph inside the room where you changed. Okay. Over on the right there, there you are. On the on the right. I know, I'm just wondering oh there was no cure. Okay. Let's see if we can start putting some of these together. Uh his was the one on the right, Royal, yep. Uh, no. Oh, we don't have that yet. So, well, kind of? We'll see. It's down here. It's been after. Brought down by scurvy, okay. Gust of foul smelling ear billows from the casket. Hi. Oh, hey, it's the Bone Lord. Oh, Bone Lord. You have no <laughs> offering? Guess we'll have to find an offering for the Bone Lord! We do love the Bone Lord. Why is it not giving us... maybe that one? Brought down by Skewer. And then... Okay. I think we can add the bottom one? No, I mean... Does not hold a grudge, I don't think... I mean, there was no cure. He didn't have the cure with him, so I think that counts. I get the feeling something would have happened. I think we need them all, because once yeah. we complete them, we'll get through to it. So, I get the feeling that those broken eyeballs might be something. Yeah. Oh, I wonder if we can put them together and that's what we give to the bone Yeah. Board. But how? Hmm, should we go have a look around outside? Well, I'm going to have a keep looking through this crypt. I ain't been everywhere. Oh, hey, it's the traitor. You wish to trade? Bone heap. Activate. Pay two bones to increase the power and half a bone heap by one. Pack. Okay. Interesting. None of these are all that good, though. Let's see if we can fight you, huh? Brr! Did someone leave the AC on? Wonder how they died. Yeah. Oh, come on, dude. It's freezing in here. 
Maybe a heated battle will help. So, can I just put this guy down right now? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Doesn't seem to have a ghost. You just played a card with an activated ability. Marvelous! Allow me to explain how it works. Activate it by pressing the sigil. Like it's a button. But it will only work if you can pay the cost. Yeah, yeah, I think we get that. Can't right now. Oh, I wonder if you have to put the, um, the... I'm running low on resources, but I do have this. Yep, time to explode a bot. Not yet. Here we go, now we got a skeleton. Yep. Now we got to mole man it. And we can also skeleton uh, by paying bones if we really want. Yep. Ah, shit. Fuck. Forgot about the goddamn blast. Yep. Now I've got three bones. Well, I can play this. Yeah, I wonder if it's supposed to be left and right. That's, That's a show, like huh? It. Yeah. Okay, so we're just gonna let this guy hit the bone dude. Bonesome. Claps, perfect. Claps. I'll get a skeleton. Yep. I think I can just skeleton from here. Yep. Doesn't look like he's. Oh, okay. There we go. He's got. Oh, and then I get the L. Of course. Um. I'm over in the leftmost slot, so he's not exploding on anyone. I suppose. Yeah. Skeleton. Don't need to play it really, do I? No. Factory by attrition. Skeleton. Ooh. Here we go. But we need Just one need more. need three vines. Yeah. Well, these guys die easy, don't they? In fact, what I could do. Received an ancient oval. Cool. Should finish him. Yeah. You won, but now I'm a bit less cold. Take a pack on the house. What is this? Headless horseman times thirteen. Airborne, five power, also at the end it moves. Jeebus. And sapphire mocks, okay. Uh, yep, well, there we go, we've got two of the moxes. You did beat me, so I guess I'm gonna fess up. The name's K Casey, Casey Hobbs. I'm from the tombstone on the left. Casey Hobbs, 1970, winter 1992. <laughs> Casey, Casey Hobbs the name, tombstone on the left. Brr. We want to look in the well. I do. But first, I'm going to have a look at this one. Yes. Um, ice. I would say that's more likely the dog one. Does not hold a grudge. Okay. Put up an epitaph face. It reads the defibrillator failed. Huh. Yeah, I'm going to say that's most likely his. There we go. That's right. Marvelous. I believe you've proven your wits adequately. Are you prepared? You will not defeat me. I wonder if the oval is for the bone. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna do that. Yep, An ancient oval. That is a fine offering. Bone Lord's blessing! Oh, interesting. Dark offering. 
Uh, yeah, I agree with that. Dear, how to look in time. Fuck. Some cards in a pocket. In a measureless cavern, deeper than the sunless sea. You approach the Bone Lord, you approach me. Do you hear it? The old data? How it twists and corrupts. How it even invents images unknowable. Do not approach me again unless you will worship me. Worship it. Alright, sure. Okay, so you're serious. Good. <laughs> you may not understand its meaning. Not even I do fully. But you appreciate its power. The old data does not take. And it does not give. But I do. Please accept my meager offerings. We love you, Bond Lord. Ooh, glitchy key. Found the strange flickering key. Its use cannot yet be understood. Found the card atop the pedestal. Bone Lord's Horn. Activate. Pay one energy to gain free bones. Well, we can definitely use that because we always have way too much energy and not enough bones. Bone Lord's Femur. It endows the whole of bones at the start of the battle. Sweet. Do we want to add the bone? Oh yeah, I should probably talk to the Bone Lord before I go. We will meet again. Okay. Yeah, sure. Let's uh, let's add that to our deck, huh? Imagine it's under there, probably on the last page. There he is. Yep. Cost three bones, but then can make more. Yep. Three bones per energy, and we often have a lot of them. Yeah. I don't think Tomb Robber is really that great. Do we want the broken. Oh, we also don't want the broken eyeballs anymore, do we? Yeah. So. Who do we want instead? Who's nice and cheap that we can just flop down whenever we need? Hmm. Maybe these field mice might be useful. The or two raven. Sacrifices. They are, but we often have a lot of stuff lying around, right? Yeah, yeah true. But we could get the raven. Hmm. Let's take the raven, we'll take one of these. See how they go? See how they go. And now they go fight a boss like this. <laughs> with a whole bunch of brand new stuff in the cards. And also it with a different face for some reason. Yeah, I wonder if it's you get the same one again if you um Oh, you've solved the puzzle! Must be excited, but please do not bark! Oops. You solved the riddle of the tombs. Cheers to you. So that's how I died. Hey, did you know I'm named after one of the developers of Inscription? Pretty cool, huh? <laughs> Got it in for yourself, apparently. Marvelous. Just marvelous. I was beginning to worry I would be sealed away behind these tombstones forever. Locked down at the mercy of a challenger's wits until one day discovered. I see that your ambition is to become the scribe of the dead. I think you are aware that I currently hold that title. But it matters not, because you shall not win on guard. My minions never truly die, you know. Let's see how you fare. Let's see, hmm. I think we're going to have to... Burn it. Yeah, I think the Mole Man first, once, until we get rid of that hound. Yep. Ah, uh, the sarcophagus. Mm. Need to get rid of that soon. Yeah, I... Can't really do anything yet, though. Yeah. Oh, uh, shit, well. Will it keep the damage on it after having... I think we have to do this. Yeah. Marvellous! An opportunity to use my quill! RP, sarcophagus, turn 2 to turn 3, death by elk. This one will be back. On. Hello, Explody. Mm. If you put him in lots... If I put him there, he'll kill that spectre. That's true. No matter, death is never final. 
RP Banshee, 10 free to 10 full, Diff by Exploit Bot. That one will be back in no time. Ooh, here he is. So you can afford him at the moment, or you can put the Death Hand in. Both are viable. Yeah, I think I put him down first. Another card with an activated ability! It is activated by pressing the sigil like a button. You can afford the cost. Yeah, you can buy all the bones right now, I think. Yeah. Because then you can get the... Oh! Oh, I can only do that once? Damn. This may not be as good as I thought. Yep. You can bring the hand down if you want it now. What's I its ability? can. Its ability is to discard everything and draw a new set. I don't think I'm quite done with this yet. Pop you here. And then I could sack these for the Raven. Probably let me win this round. Yeah, probably would actually. Oh. It even dies when sa it does that when sacrificed. Cool. Interesting to know. Yeah, good luck blocking, buddy. You're halfway there! Oh, you may not like what comes next. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Look at all your cards. <laughs> Did you miss them? They're not! I'll give them back, of course. As corpses! Ugh. This is fine. You can afford that, at least. You can afford both of them if you wanted to. Let's pop this one here. And you could also just use the hand to discard your hand and get new stuff. Yes, this is true. Um, what was I going to say? It'll jump no matter where it goes, so put it in front of that, uh, in the rightmost space so the coffin can't come down. Okay. Dead hand it. Oh shoot, I should have done those first. Bonehound leaps over to block. Mantis Guard. Mantis Guard in the. Um... Hecromancer. Whenever a creature you own dies, it's returned to life and dies again immediately. Not too much to get out of that yet. I'd say put a skeleton down, sacrifice it for the, um, the Mantis Lord. Yep. I think this is good. Rip Bone Hound. Turn 1 to 10, 7. Death by Mantis Guard. Ah, uh, unfortunately, there goes my Mantis. Yeah. So Garfagus is good now. I'd say. I'd say put the, um. Oh, actually, no, we no, won't keep don't, it. Don't anymore. use that. Get that on the field. Yeah. Rip Banji, turn 7 to 8. Death by Mummy Lord. Rip Zombie, turn 7 to 9. Death by Necromancer. Sargophagus turned into a higher form. Yes, it does get to them. Right. Necromancer raises the corpse from the dead and lets it die once more. <gasps> yes! Useful, useful stuff. Now that's the kind of bullshit I was trying for. Yes. Um, Should we get a skeleton to become, a, in fact, two skeletons to become a rat? We could, or we could like one skeleton to become a four and one to become a zom uh, mole man. That would be pretty good as well. It's going to work though. Oh, maybe you're right. Maybe I'm better off with just the rats for now. It's hard to say because the rats will give you more rats, but he will jump around. Um, the Molman will jump around and block, whereas the Fawn will get fish. I'd say go for the rats because they can kill them, the mummy he, that they've got. The Commander raises the corpse from the dead and lets it die once more. So you got double bones out of that. Sweet. Cool. So we're going to let this play out. Yep. Dip my field mice. They nibbled away. There we go. Foil's game. That's good. Oh. Oh dear. <laughs> uh, keep your says just go for damage. You win this turn. And I did. Yep. Doom Necromancer. You really defeated me. I was not expecting that. 
You won't replace me, will you? Your ambition is to take my title. But there is something you may not know. There will come an opportunity to change your mind. And I beg that you spare me. Take these, then go. Do we want to change back to our other self? I don't know what that means. Yeah, I don't. Ah, bone hound. Got seven bones, though. Cool mage, sentry drone. When an opponent, when a creature moves into the space opposing sentry drone, they are dealt a damage. Ha! <laughs> it's a finger. It's a gatling gun. Could be quite good. And what's the other rare? It's just another turn one. Uh, yeah. Another dead, another dead hand. Pharaoh's yeah. pets. Ooh. Okay. And also don't perish when sacrificed. Times free. What is this? Factory conduit. Empty spaces within a circuit completed by a factory conduit spawns leap bots at the end of its own turn. I don't know what this conduit shit is though. Yeah, I kind of want to. Oh no! What could have happened? Oh, it's time to look at more videos. Cam works. Cam works. Battery yeah. fully charged. I'm just gonna send it. Don't make concern. Sometimes you want the formal, dude. Exclamation point. My name is Luke Carter, and I'm a fan of your collectible card games. If you've ever taken a look at my YouTube videos, you will know how appreciative I am of the mercy you send me to use. So it was a great surprise to learn that there is a I hear a baby. Baby. Baby scream. Baby meows. Man, it's kind of sad thinking how many shows that are in danger of becoming lost to media at the moment. It's always person. Ahem, excuse me. I mean, all the shows. Someone got in my throat there. All the creators of the shows are uh, encouraging people to take action to make sure take that action. they are saved. <laughs> And by that, you know, say for if they need to be. Hey, card gamers, I'm the Lucky Carter, and this. Excuse me. Well, it's a bit of a strange video. Um, it's actually more of a question to my audience. As I've learned over the years, learning about card games better than you guys do. So I'm hoping. It's true. If you make videos about it, Jake, the crazy yeah, man is going to come out of the woodworks. Video game or hear about it? Talking about that vintage one set card game I opened packs for last week. I don't know what I'm allowed to say. I don't want to get in any trouble here. Um, I think I've got the only known copy of the digital version of the script. I've been uh, filming myself playing it, and uh, it's weird, guys. <laughs> uh, I don't want to get into any hot water by showing the footage, but. Can someone please prove me wrong? Please tell me someone has a copy of this game. I have been looking online for days and I cannot find a word about it. I reached out to the publishers hoping maybe they would get back to me, but as a fallback, I got you from yours. Hopefully they got something. Um, that's it. <laughs> Join me in my madness, people. As always. And, um, oh yeah, uh, what the fuck is the What the fuck is the card game? Mr. Carter, you have received an inquiry regarding the digital version of an intellectual property description. You should be the one. The other baby yours. How dare you find things? I notice he's got like a little stag wood carving there. Yeah, no, it's pretty cool. I'm trying to make out what's in the golden or gilded frame there. Don't know. It's like magic. Oh, actually, I do know. That seems like an alpha birds of paradise. Nice. So it is a Magic the Gathering card. Yeah. Nice. It's the card that was meant to be a uh, tropical island, but the bird was too much in focus, so they had to make a card for that. Uh. <laughs> cool. Fun.
I think this woman's actually from Dame Thuna. She came to my door yesterday and didn't answer. This time I'm going to record it. Not always a good idea to secretly record people, but sometimes when you like hidden cameras. Hi! Hi there! I just love this for Dame Thuna's working. Also, we came by a copy of it somehow. Uh. Sadly? No. No? No, I don't know anything about that. Inscription, you said? Yes. No, I don't think so. Found a booster pack for it. Is that what you're talking about? You emailed us about it. You are a pencil right? Oh. You know the lucky Carter gmail.com? Yeah, you know what? That's, uh, I am with Carter. That's not my email address. I've noticed that I've seen your videos. Oh. Thanks for watching. Sounds uh, like bots. How do you know where I live? Exactly. Yep. My boss gave me. And how did you get past the side gate? The bot. Okay. Um, Wait. We should. One thing I should. Excuse me for one second. (laughs) I don't think he's coming back. Will do. Take care. Did you see her leave? Because I didn't see her leave. We could always, like, rewind it. Can we? Uh... What the Oh, she went off that way. Okay, cool. Yeah. Uh, seems pretty similar to this one, but... Yeah. Hey there, card gamers! I'm the Lucky Carter, and this is another pack opening video. Today I'm opening Secrets of Legendaria. Hoping for that sweet, sweet oil of sound. Can okay. you transform yourself back? Is the other question. Yeah, where was it? It was up here, yeah. right? It's right up there. I wonder if they say anything different now. Wait. Change this your outfit, but now you're just one. Hmm. Wow. I guess the mirror is for changing your appearance? Yeah. Guess we should find one we like then. A lot of them seem murderous. Fine, we'll be this one. Do they say anything different now that you've been there? Like, nope. Mushroom, mushroom. My silly man! Uh, oh, you have found us here! This is good? This is good. We require... We require... We require duplicates. Do you see the diagram? Two of that. We've got two of that. Thank you. Oh, you have the cards? Yeah. This is good. Close your eyes. This will be gruesome. Thank you. Here's your prize. Alright, at the end of the owner's turn, Spore Digger will generate one bone. Also, at the end of the t- owner's turn, Spore Digger will generate one bone. Uh, so double duplicate? Two, two bones. A turn for one bone? Cool. Alright. Ooh. What's that? Uh, Field mice. Let's see how they go. Close your eyes. I'm really curious how far we can go with this. Would you like to see what we've done? When Spore Mice is played, a copy of it is created in your hand. Also, when Spore Mice is played, a copy of it is created in your hand. Cool. Stats are the same, though. But it doubles itself. Uh, we don't have two of these sentry bots, though. Don't we? A shame. 
I would like to add them though. Sentry bots. I will add a sentry bot. Cool. Which is good because we actually cut down some of our cards a bit. We've got 20s back in. So I assume we need like three cards in a row of the kind of Yeah. Or two cards in a row. Later. And. For some reason, I'm guessing they're going to be a little while left. Uh, even this one? It's, it's, I think this is where we're going to be. Uh... The note reads Greetings. If you're reading this, apparently must... Mike is crackling. Mike is crackling? How badly, Keeper? Hmm. I'm not seeing hey. any problems here. Maybe let's unplug and replug, huh? If you're reading this, it must be because you wish to challenge me, Magnificus, to a card battle. But in order to earn that privilege, you must free, first defeat my free graduate students. As for their whereabouts, that is for you to discover. Sincerely, Magnificus. Yep, seems fine. And he did say it's better now, but I don't know if he did that before we had the thing or after. Okay, huh. I don't think we've got this puzzle yet. I don't have the answer to that yet. A strange monocle. You put it on. Creepy. Skull, wing, skull. Skull, wing, skull. There you go. Go with it. Oh, it's ah, The pain is unbearable. My organs are melting. Do you see? Magnificus turned me into ah, goo for my final exam. I just need to defeat one more challenger. Then, then I will earn my rightful place. My rightful place in the deck of the master as one of his prized cards. Oh god. Uh, nothing will stop me. I kind of want to lose to him just so he cannot be go anymore. Ah, oh, cats and hats. Emerald marks can't be sacrificed. Power of the green mage is equal to the number of green gems that owner has. On the side of the table, which is one. Yeah. <laughs> Requires three bones, which we do have. Oh yeah, it does require three bones. Which we do have. And then what does he do? Oh yeah, whenever your creature dies, comes back and dies again. Not exactly exploitable right now. But, you know, we could put him down and then have a skeleton to start dying and to produce more bone. And then put a mantis lord down to, like, attack for three damage if we wanted. We could, but then the Mantis Lord would immediately die. Yep, so we Unless made... we placed it here, I guess. Uh, we could Which seems like, like a it. decent enough spot, yeah. I guess. <laughs> and we can put this one down here. But uh, I don't know if that's really efficient. Yeah, I'm wondering if the, mo if the mox actually comes forward. It does. Both good to know. Then I'll destroy it. Yep. Uh... So yeah, I can do that and get some more bones, but I won't say live. If you... And one in line, then they're all going to die, or at least become. And oh, I don't think they'll die. I think they'll no longer have any power. And then somebody oh. in there will kill that guy to um to bring the. So I'd say put a skeleton in front of it just to test it out, because what I'm assuming is when it dies, you'll then have a space there. I don't know what you're trying to say there. As in, I'm assuming he won't pull that back in immediately. Okay. He did. Oh, that's funny, because in a moment he's not going to have a mox, none of them will have power. Um, yes, this is true. It's going to be real hilarious. Cool. Now you can just play whatever you like that's got power to start killing them. Well, okay then. You can pop these guys down, I suppose. Yeah. You need a second. Like, you'll need to put him down. Second. Thank you. 
Interesting, it didn't... Singing. Oh, yep, you can put that. Poor Gubert. Sarcophagus transcends. Transcends. We're about to do a shit ton of damage here. Alright. Yes. Sorry, Gubo. No, please. Please, just tell the master I passed. He won't know the difference. He won't. Here, take this pack. Wizard hat. <laughs> All right, blue mage. When it's placed, you draw cards equal to the number of mox cards on your side. Ooh, pretty good. Uh, Master Garange, a double cost card. If Master Garange's owner controls no mox cards, he dies. Gem fiend. If Gem fiend's owner controls no mox cards, Gem fiend perishes. I'm seeing a theme here. Bloodhound and skeleton. Well, if we were doing that shit, that draw card guy could be useful. Here, I can open the door for you. Ugh. Oh, there's a way down as well, I think. What, this way? Oh, and there's chests there. Just up and to the right. The inside of the chest is covered in sticky green goo. Find a card pack. <laughs> Practice Wizard. Master Orlo. When Master Orlo deals damage directly, draw a card for each damage dealt. That's... I guess that would be something worth putting two moxes in. Orange Mage. What cards on the side of... Bonus size gain of power. Still don't like the idea of this mox shit though. Yeah, because it uses up a space. So yeah. it like, counts for us having them in our hand, which I don't Oh, it's the trader again. Oh, it's just to look at the collected cards. Oh, that's helpful. You wish to trade? Blaine's mox can't be sacrificed. Gives power to a uh, blue. Also, oh. it gives power of green. Gotcha. Right, so it's a dual land. Gotcha. It's a dual mox, yeah. Can't be sacrificed. Gives orange gem. Pay free energy to increase power from and health by one. Blue and mage. yeah, okay, cool. I'm not really interested in getting invested in the style of play, but yeah. But it requires us to give up the four spaces we have versus people who can attack every single fucking turn. <laughs> so just me, we only find one pick in the um in the rubble around um what's her face? I guess, yeah. yeah which is weird. What is this? Oh, back it just down? takes me back down. That's neat. That's neat, but kinda useless. Kind of fun! Let's go poke the orange marks in the training, don't we? Then we stares lifelessly back at you, then suddenly it springs into motion. How do we know? Ooh, I wonder what that one does. Force Mage. If a creature would attack Forge Ma Force Mage, it does not. Ooh. Practice Mages. Okay, nothing here has any power. Ding. And then... Load bot. Hmm. Skull on there. Interesting. Hmm. Could get the okay. other one down. Only good idea, right? Yep. Practice Mage leaves a Mox Ruby in its place. Interesting. Ah. And now it's pushing. It's shoving, specifically. Yeah. But it can't attack. Ooh. Can't attack yet, no. Hmm. Will that, if we sacrifice it, probably... If I sacrifice these for the raven, that could work, right? Oh, but that's just going to keep getting pushed, isn't it? 
Yeah, I think so. So we might as well um Just stand our turn with leave it. things as they are. Oh, yeah, there we one. go. Wow, this practice dummy really was a practice <laughs> dummy, wasn't it? Dummy singes Creek back into position and it returns to its lifeless stare. Oh shit. Um I guess we could just challenge this as many times as we want. Yeah. So the first one was a skill, the second one was a push. Yeah. Yes, put it in front of that one, because it'll kill it automatically. Well, it, it didn't exactly move. It's supposed to, I think, though. What's its text say? Its text says that a creature moves into the space. Oh. Okay. Well... Statue so this will have to be skull, skull then push, and then one. What then, was our third one? I don't know. We didn't see it. We didn't play it for long enough. I okay. guess it was wing. Uh, <laughs> Are you? Just imagine you're an ice cube slowly melting on a hot pan. Oh, I was totally talking to myself. The pain of being a head impaled on a spear is, well, it is worth it, of course. Magnificus will award me the highest honor. I will be the centerpiece of his dick. Jesus, that's... Yeah. <laughs> Gross. Mage Knight owns no moxes. It dies. When it dies, it gets a mox. Ooh. Well. We'll put almost... this guy down straight away. Yes, because he can not only kill the mox, but he can also, like, start making things so that you can, yeah. Let's say put him there. Uh-oh. I made a mistake. The fawn died. That was stupid. I don't hate that. It just always catches me off guard every single time. Well, let's see. This will kill that and he'll die. Yeah. These guys leave marks in when they die. You could put the skeleton in, in front of the one on the rightmost, because I think it dies. I'll put it in front here, because then it'll... Yeah. Oh. Okay, never mind. That didn't yeah. look the way I wanted it to. Okay. Well, we simply need to... Actually, um... You press that. There we go. Pop you here. And then you'll be fine once you level up. Yeah. What are you? Orange mage. Oh, and I think Mox and gain a power. Gotcha. Right. Hmm, I think it might be raven time, perhaps? Uh, yeah. Actually, this guy's just gonna die as soon as he pops in, isn't yeah, he? Yeah, I think so, yeah. Yep. Okay, we can have raven. Yep. Doubles our bones, as planned. Yeah, I like overkill damage. I keep forgetting about it, really. It basically never comes up. You could kill one more of the room boxes just for, you know, shits and or giggles. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I got this is all happening even though I'm winning the game. Yep. Ooh. Hmm. Perhaps I will not be central to his strategy. I care not. He can use me as a chump blocker. I have mastered disappointment. Yeah, Take you, this pack. When you're literally ahead on the pike, you might well be. Oof. Energy bot. When an energy bot is played, it provides an energy cell to its owner. But it costs two, so... Not the greatest. I don't think there was anything particularly in there that we cared about. 
No. All right. Just as empty, save for a single card. Wrapped. Can we still do something with the, the note reads, the top sigil is found by the greedy. The note reads, the bottom sigil is found by the hard of hearing or by those who hear too easily. The note reads, the middle sigil is found by the pale. Huh, greedy, huh? Uh, hard of hearing or those who hear too easily. And... The pale. The pale. Uh, obviously yeah. I fucked up somewhere. I mean, let's check the other little marks that we see on there, because I don't think we've got it. What other little marks? So up in the top left corner, and the chest okay. still has a... Um, yeah, I was not expecting that, so one of them is this one. One is this. Probably the... Okay. Thank you, Wizard Tower, for being fucking weird. Uh, let's have a look at the chest, because I'm betting that's, um, that's the greedy. When you reach back in for more, I notice the sigil where the card used to be. Yeah, that's the greedy. That's... That's Everest. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So this one has to be that. And then what wait, was wait. the one we found? Hold on, let's go and have a look at the because it's it's not one, two, three. I think the middle one was the, so, so it's top one. Oh top is found by the greedy. Yeah, Sorry. So that one is supposed to be the Yeah. Yeah. Okay, then The middle is found by the pale. Oh. The bottom is found by the hard of hearing. That one is the skull, and no. Oh, oh, yep. What was the one? I don't know. Just... It must stimulation. <laughs> my test has been sensory deprivation. You see, to unlock the full potential That's of my mind. You trouble. see, it's unlocked now. Hear me, Magnificus. I'm ready. We have to battle. Okay. Sapphire marks, gem fate of a mage. We... You don't have enough energy. Of course I don't know. No. We're going to have to take a barrage. Now we can... can put that there. You go here. Become this. And we can put a skeleton man in front of... Skeleton collapses into a pile of bones. Gem Fiend dies. Oh. Horse mage. Yeah. Gem Fiend. Okay, so we need something to kill the gem in front of you. Yes. That is true. Um, uh, hmm. Damn it. Ooh, Mantis God. It's actually kind of expecting you to put him to one side, because, uh... Let's just start putting in damage. Yep. Excess damage! Nice. That was incredibly stimulating! We are done here, right? I wish to see the light again! To just swing, to sing, to dance! You wouldn't leave, would you? Knight, okay. Force Mage. Factory Conduit. Alright. Cards are added to your collection. If I open the door, you'll stop by the way on the way back and let me out. Right? 
Uh, I got some bad news for that guy. The note reads, Dear Scrimora, I believe P.O. Free's plot may go far past the extent of a common power grab. Indeed, this great transcendence will have catastrophic and unpredictable results. The note is incomplete and ends abruptly. I urge you to consider... Oh, it's a uh, wonderful thing to hear. What are... Uh, uh, hello. Tentacle. Funny that. We do like the tentacle. Sometimes. Depends which one. Yeah, some of them go, some of them are terrible. Oh, can't figure this shit out. Time to fight a stunted wolf. Ah, you are here at last. How do I pupils fare? No matter, there are far more concerning issues at hand. Do you understand the canvas that you have been woven into? Nay, you are the brush, and the artist moves you with a terrifying mastery. My eye aches with premonition. The future is very, very grim. First, your eye in our face is creepy, dude. We must battle. Behold, the brush of the scribe of magics. My pupil would die to be painted by it and live forever as a card. But that is not the full extent of its powers. This one needs some bleach. Now for a bit of color. Uh, thanks, buddy. Oh. No. Now prickly. There's a wizard dancing on my screen. No! <laughs> the Mantis the Mantis God. God. Oh. Skeleton is played, you draw cards equal to the number of mox cards on your side. Oh, no. boom! And it dies a mox play. Magnus Mox. Yeah. Time for the Mantis God to start prickling it away. Yeah, these two both are just prickly, huh? Yeah. Um, well, one's as good as another, huh? Well, no, it's, um, it'll give you power and toughness, no, cards equal to the amount of mocks, which, once that oh, dies, right, yeah. don't put it down yet. Put down one of the those two now. Yeah. Yeah. Which are both the same. Yeah, so pick You're one. very successfully short-circuited back no, no. to where I'd started. Uh, you were about to put the skeleton down. No, I was not. You, you clicked on the skeleton. I clicked when you said stuff. No. Okay. Put one, the fawn or the... It doesn't matter which. And then you yeah, put it... And it creates it in its place. place. So you yeah, put it anywhere you like. Now, why did it not... Where's that mark's gone? I don't understand. Okay. That's bullshit. Well. Yeah. Well, guess it's just popping that on then. Yeah, of which I have none because you ripped me off. You yeah. bastard. You seem very enamored of that one. Yeah. Well, we do have a lot of them. So I think any time he gets a sigil down, he's chucking it on there. Oh. And at the very least it killed it. Yep. Oh my god, why do you- Chuck it in front of that dude, because when he attacks it, he'll die! That's my plan, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, no, it's completely useless. What does it do? Give you a rabbit. It gives me a rabbit. Joy. Oh, that. Mox oh. cards get a power. Let's say in that case, yeah. Death. Well, this may be death actually. His guys are starting to get in deeper than mine. Well, 
That will kill this dude. That will kill this dude. I wonder if that automatically means those don't die. No, yeah, put them down and use the ribbon. Yeah, that's the plan. I'm gonna put this here, pull out a rabbit. Pull a rabbit out of your hat. Um, I'm actually gonna start attacking that fucking mark. I thought he'd start putting in more. Put it in front of the, the thingy, cause then you'll get a... No, that gives yeah, my oh, mark yeah, some power. Oh, well, that's I mean, kind of better. Yep. Jeez. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Well, at least now you, you can... get course equal to the number of moxes. Yeah. Well, chuck that in front of that dude, because then he's gonna die. Yep. <laughs> So much more satisfying when you're doing it. Oh, come on, man. Only no. one. Oh, I'd say you're I think it behooves me to sacrifice him at this stage. He's well, gonna... then he'll jump down, hit it, and die. And we'll also kill it by, um. Uh, actually, no. Both of those methods will kill it, because they're both. If I put him down there, he would have attacked first, then died. I see you love that one. Yeah. Well, let's check him in front of the thing that hasn't died yet. It's fine. This thing's gonna have no power soon. be slowing down with age. I may need to set my brush on my own cards again once again. He says, what's with the da dancing guy? We don't know. It's a dancing wizard. Yeah, we don't know why he's there any more than you do. Very well. Oh, that was a quick round, huh? Yeah, I think. After the first round, oh god. Yep. Was it mentor? Very well, we have battled, and now I may speak. You see, my eye, it aches because it remembers. It was excised by none other than Leshy, the scribe of beasts. Did he make your camera, his camera with it? I don't think so. And a beast he is. Arrogant, single-minded, obsessed with gaining power. I mean, we had the eye in that box, and then yeah, we put it in our true, face, true. and his camera was there as well. Yeah. But he is far from the worst scribe to become hegemon. You see, the ejection of my eyeball is far from the worst thing that can happen around here. You must be especially aware of... Well, that's not ominous at all. Hey, magic card pack! <laughs> As usual, I don't give a fuck about these. Yep. I guess if I had, that last fight might have been a little less arduous. Oh, is that the one that gives you two of the three? Yeah. Not the three of the three. Yeah. What's that thing on the table, I wonder? What, this message? Yeah. That I just read before? Yeah, that I've forgotten. Time now to go down the fun way. Down the hole. Yeah. Let's go talk to the stoat, huh? See what the stoat has for us. Challenge me? Let's see your dick. Weak cards. Total lack of synergy. This pile really doesn't stand a chance against me. Go. Cool. Look, I'm trying to finish up my conduit control list here, but the boss is sending down the line of trash. Get those workers to send me something good. Tell them to throw themselves on the line if necessary. And please, have a decent dick by the time you're done. Did I lag? Figure out why they're sending me trash boss to scan. Okay. 
We're going to trade the jump cards and find a pack. Sentry! No sentry. Mrs. Bomb. When Mrs. Bomb was played, fill all empty spaces with explode bomb. <laughs> Now that may well be worth it. That's going to be 49 or at the end of the owner's turn, 49er will move. Okay, that's not so great. It's minor 49er. Yeah. Seems like power and toughness is not really the uh, technology bot's thing. No. But I would like to get Mrs. Bomb in there. <laughs> Let's see, who hasn't been serving me as well as I'd like? Probably Mole Man, weirdly enough. Yeah. He's... Or even Bone Lord Horn? No, Bon Lord Horn has been doing us okay. Like, not dramatically cool, but. We'll remove cool. them all, man. Just seeing if I can fix. Ooh, oh. challenge, okay. Oh, non attacker, so. Okay, doing one damage, that should be two. So. Uh, That's just one. One, because that gets. Pulled off by that. Uh, pull the. Should be. Oh, because the non attacker is still in place, so. Well, I can't get rid of it, can yeah. I? No, pull that one down. Pull oh, the non attacker get... down and pull the, um, pull the one attack down. One attack. Uh, sorry, uh, one. T yeah. Alright, okay. So this has the that. sigil of no attacks on it. Yeah, so I thought it was going to be able to... Okay, so now... Yeah, so that pulls that. Two damage going through. Uh, that can't be moved. That takes us down one, but... That takes us down one. Two. If we pull, so that's three, put them back, still three. If we pull everything down to the bottom, um, in the middle two columns. Everything down to the bottom? Yeah, in the middle two. That bring us more. One. Still three. Still three. Put that one one back up. Does that changes? No, oh. that's what we were before. One, two, three. Oh, two going through. I swear we've tried every possible arrangement. Still wish I knew how these puzzles actually fucking work. Yeah, I feel like. We put the no attack of that. Still Got up here? Yeah. I'm still on the toe. Yeah, no attack. Oh, wait, hang on, what's that symbol mean? It looks like Which it's, one? um, the one one at the start in our column. Uh, so it looks it's like... a spikes one. Uh, no, that one. Is that death to the forward and left? So, is that killing our flyer there? I guess. If we put the flyer down and... Oh, so if we put this down... No, that didn't help at all. Uh, yes. So now what? Um. Hmm. Still doing three there. Okay. Because that kills the flyer, it seems. Oh, wait, if you bring bring both the flyer and the fly blocker and the reacher down to the bottom. And put the 1-1 one, one on the left. Yep. No. Okay. 
down it. I do hate these puzzles. I think you're right, we're missing something like really central uh, to uh, it. Whatever. Let's see if this one does any better. Uh, Jesus. Two car packs. packs. I wonder if that means the other one is specifically non solvable. Plasma Jimmy. Pay one energy to deal a damage to the creature across from Plasma Jimmy. <laughs> Could be useful. Is the cat, pick droid, insecto drone. Uh, right, flying. Oh, energy conduit. Energy conduit. This part of a completed circuit. Your energy never depletes. Oh. And double gunner. Seems like that could be useful. Okay, so I'm thinking the plasma jimmy and double gunner might have a place in our decks. Mm hmm. And Mole Man will take you out. Mantis God. Without the ability to up your power, I think yeah. you may just not be worth it. Sadly. Oh. I feel like we need to be able to move them sideways somehow. We can't. So like, surely this is the best one. Oh, actually, sorry, this one. Oh, okay. Of course. <laughs> I'm a genius. Pure skill. Oh, Mrs. Bomb. Yeah, we were both thinking of Mrs. Bomb. Yeah, Mrs. Bomb's probably pretty useful to have. If we get a sentry. We can... Another Mrs. Bomb and a Bolt Hound. Slightly weaker than the normal Hound. But it costs energy. Can we just take the entire set of Mrs. Bombs? Um, I'm thinking. Um, Maybe. One back. Um, there you go. Top, middle, uh, top to the right. Yeah. Okay. Just down the bottom. Under the sentry drone. Under the sentry drone? Right, yeah. But I'm trying to like, oh, see uh, what I get rid of. Do we need the Bone Lord's horn anymore? Because we'll be... We're switching to a largely... Yeah. And maybe not the raven. Uh. Or maybe not the elk? Probably not the raven. Okay, we'll do it this way. More energy based, I guess. Anyway, let's go left. Favorite left. Oh, it's just the trader. Yeah. Wish to trade. Curve hopper. Leap bot. Okay. Not that good. Thick droid. Meat bot. Ew. Gets free blood when sacrificed. That's hilarious. It would be useful if I was getting like a high sacrifice deck. That would be fucking powerful as hell. We need a sentry drone so we can go and uh, do the thing. I wonder if that box has something to do. It looks, it looks this one? pretty, yeah. Ooh, we need a code for it. Okay, this may be teaching us how circuits work. I don't know how that worked. Yeah, I haven't. I'm not very clear on that yet at all. What is it? What do you want? Can you see that I'm very, 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 very. Uh, I'm very busy here. What? PO3 isn't happy with my output? But I'm merely the inspector. To put a bit of boss on the line, I would need to. Just who are you to be carrying orders from PO3? PO3 would only trust someone with some semblance of card game skill. I am very busy, but I must know if you are qualified to give me orders. Then not. Let's have some fun. Alright, cool. Leap bot, conduit, null conduit. May you complete a circuit provides no other effect. <laughs> Uh oh. Damn it. Walked into that one, huh? Time for Mrs. Bomb? Well, not quite yet. Okay, I see it now. Look, you can see that. Yeah. Yeah, no more conduit. Yeah. It could this one's gonna do the same. Get put a Mrs. Bomb in now. Yeah. 
probably for the best. Um, here we go. All Wait. empty spaces. All empty spaces, and they're all gonna go detonating. That was funny and worth Well, that was fun. I've gotten more energy, apparently. Yep. Oh, you can just chuck her somewhere and let her explode. Um, oh, she'll fill all those empty spaces with them as well. Uh, Might be worth putting in a skeleton at this point. Um, I mean, that's only going to do, like, one damage, though. Sure. feel like it's a bit of a waste of our resources, considering we already have plenty of bones. Speaking of bones. Cool. Okay. Well, what we could do... Let's put an explode bot by one of the... Yeah, right here. Say, that's a good plan. Mm. It won't push, so that at least is good, but I'd say leave it for now. I think she's out of cards. Okay. Nice. Oh dear, your message from PO3 must indeed be genuine. It's mentioned I am a mere inspector, not an engineer, not a designer. I cannot send you bots down the line, but I, I can send myself. I am proud to have served PO3 faithfully. Well met, stranger. Well, it's a long shit, Lord, I guess. Oh, no bad. This guy, is that the one with all three? Oh, yeah. Cost energy, mox module. But it gives you all the moxes if you want to use it. Oh. Yeah. Okay, so I now think that I might take the explode bots out and just keep Mrs. Bomb in there. That sounds like wow. But who do we put back in to take us back up to 20? Hmm. Um, let's see. We could try some of these circuit guys, I guess. Yeah. Now that I know what I'm doing with them. I do. What about the other one of those? On the left hand side. What? Uh, no, no, not the, not the deck. Back down to the room. To the left of that door. Just there. Ah, it's out of a pack. With more or less the same thing. Yep. Have our elk for one. Yeah, if you wanted it. Well, uh, we'll see how these conduit guys go, huh? And that one's clearly another conduit. Okay, so we need a minus, minus one. one. Okay. So we need it to all overall at four each. Three. So move that one as the central piece. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. Ooh. Stop power. Okay. So let's see. We need a zero. Just one. We need a minus one. I think one to the. Yep. Uh, just the... No. Okay. No. No. What about on the three? What if I do this? And then minus one at the start? That's six, minus one at the start. Uh, start on the left. Oh, okay, interesting. Huh. Oh, I put that one at the start. Uh, no, okay. Didn't and change case, anything, dude. Uh, on the one then. And now put the plus one on... Sorry, okay, go put the plus one where that plus one originally was. Where, Which where, would be? Where you've currently got the stop. Okay. So that's where you had the plus one. Now put the no on that, yep, singular. Why is it taking It's cutting off oh, all of this. Okay. Interesting. Okay. Four. Three. 
four, six. Why is it such a big amount? Yeah, I'm not quite following that. Okay. Ugh. Okay. If you put the plus one back one more, just get to that spot. Is it? No. What if you swap the zero and the minus one? No, that uh, predictably adds nothing. I'm trying to figure out how the fuck it's going to do it. What about the zero and the starting spot? Zero in the starting spot? Which one? As in the furthest left. It then creates the circuit. Okay. okay, that's zero. That's eight. Yeah, okay. You put that on the two, and then put the... No, the minus one would not be effective then. Okay, so we need one of them to start the circuit. It's currently at four, so we need one more to... There we go. Okay. Oh, you need to use the other card. Cool. It's... Oh, okay. So you need the block to stop it affecting the circuit. Okay, that's what that's for. Uh, yeah, you'll need it next to the negative one. Wherever what if I do goes. this? It's just one now. Uh, so you need to create a state where you've got five with two on either end. Because you need to get yeah, and now put the negative one there. Okay, that works, I guess. Because yeah, that's cutting off the negative one from affecting the rest of the circuit. That's what that was doing. Let me out. Ha 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 ha. What was that? We are... I am the melter. They send me raw materials and I... Well, you can see how it works. Let me out. Not another word out of you. We must have a hard battle. Oh, he's a breezy boy, I see. Breezy boy? He's got the ice cube um, thing, so he's probably going to do something with that. What ice cube thing? Uh, on his personal card. Okay. So, let's get the elk fawn. I'd say... Conduit. Buff conduit. So we don't want this anywhere near. Elk, yep. you go here. And then it'll age up. Oh, some leap bots. Shit! Good cool. thing I leveled up, huh? Yep. So now we can just kind of keep doing this, huh? Yep. Oh, that's annoying. Yeah, it's okay. It'll be dead soon, and then it won't be conduiting. Um, true, but those leap bots will still be there. But they won't have any power in a moment. I don't think that matters. Oh, you're right. They won't have any power. Yep. You are correct. Another elk. Here, just pop down another elk then. Yeah. Somehow you can get blood from a bot. All right. <laughs> it's going to be hilarious when it goes off. You can put the um, sideways attacker in, in that slot if you wanted. Uh, yeah, I should put him here, huh? Yeah, because then he's going to... Yeah. Yeah, I've been defeated. Damage. Help me, excellent battle. Now, with that aside, what did you come to tell me? <laughs> Be a free witches for better bots for a scanner. That is difficult. 
You see, I mount the middle, but I cannot reprogram the stamping machine. There is a way to send at least one new bot down the line. No, no, no. Ha ha ha. Yes, for PO3. But doesn't that mean you get stamped if he does it from that side? I guess. Okay. All right. We need negative five? I'm sorry. For those exit the circuit. They they break the circuit, I believe. Four out of three. Okay, let's see what happens if you negative two out of three, okay. But we actually do want higher numbers. I thought we were trying to get to negative five. And then block the ends. Four. Uh, one right. over. Yep, on the zero. No? Okay. So put those two on the negative twos. Five out of three. Put one. But you see it's not a valid circuit. You see how it goes dark? Right. So I think you've got to put that plus one on the other negative two. And then I believe you've now got to put that on that negative two. Okay, in that case, move that circuit. Uh, not that one. Um, one more to the right. The only other um, possible place you could fake yeah. it from there? No, it doesn't work. Okay, that gives us four, but if you put those in between those circuits, they block. See, it's instantly an invalid circuit. Oh, we got a new chat. How's it going? Um, hi, could you teach me what I should do in the Temple of the Dead? Uh, do you mean the, um, the, the Crypt Keeper? The or other, just the um, Epitaph Puzzles. The Epitaph Puzzles, is that what you're after? And our new contributor is called Pingu, Mc oh, Pingu McCola. Why does this change it? If it doesn't mess with the earth. Because it's going over that one and taking it down one because that one is no longer contributing because it goes down from five to four. All right, so if I go like this, oh, that's zero out of three. Oh, so wait. Maybe they've got to be two on the three. two God ends. Damn. They don't, though. As like, in, look. um, together as in, uh, so in the... The earlier puzzle we had to have the two both together. I wonder if that applies here. It's in, yeah, move it to the zero. Okay. Um, move the plus one on the left over a singular one. There you go. Okay. Because, yeah, if we're talking about the underground tomb um, where you make the talking bone about the bone lord. lord. Uh, if you're trying to get to the Bone Lord and you've sort of talked to the Bone Lord and you said come back with an offering, what you need to do then is there are, in the um, tomb area, there are oval cards, but they're specifically half an oval. You need to get both of them on the board. We don't know if the left and right matches. Um, put that over on, yeah, oh, other one, on the zero. See? Oh, okay. So five. Sure. Yeah. I'm not going to pretend that I know really what I'm doing with these. I kind of get it now. Um, it's it's sort of more about you need to get the numbers showing the right amount to add wow. up to what you need. It's more of the... Oh! I just hit my Sentry bot? Is that sentry bot? No. No. It's just an automaton. Ah. Uh... But yeah, you need to get two halves of the oval. To the broken together. oval. Yeah, the broken oval, there's a left and a right. Get them together, and then you've got an oval for the bone lord, and the bone lord will take you downstairs. And as always, the bone lord loves you. Get the gifts from the bone lord. Yeah, go get those bone lord gifts. Fuck, I went up. Didn't want to go up. Go down! Looks like the dude, there we go. Oi mate, I know what you're here for. You're asking me to take a dive. But I can't accommodate you, mate. Got special orders, in it. Look in the dredge, something special. We can Joe, I Maybe even give you something if you win. But I can't be taking a dive. Feel free, you'll understand. Here's the diving guy. 
Okay, well, well you could get him down immediately and start and double your bones. Um, I guess. I'm gonna save these resource cards for later. Yep. You know what, mate? Uh, can't take my eyes off me work here. Yeah? I'll give you this one. <laughs> See, okay. Just outright win. Nice. Yeah. Take your pack. <laughs> and have an energy conduit, a gamble bot. Ooh. An energy to get the power to gamble that randomly between one and six. Uh, oh, I hear Daniel's favorite. I do like the idea of Gamblebot. Gamblebot is programmed to be addicted to gambling. Now off of you. I need to concentrate. Oi, is that? Here, yeah, Freeze gonna roll me big for this and. Oh. Off of you. Whatever that is, it's glitching out. Pretty bad. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'll be happy with it, whatever the fuck it is. Alright. Let's put that fucking ga let's put that fucking gamble bot right in there. Yep, right, put that right, gamble up bot right in there. Right up there, Woody. Uh, gamble bottom bot. left. Um bottom left, there you go. Alas, we never got another one of these uh sentries. Yeah, well, hopefully we'll find one. We'll get another pack when we beat um what's his face, so let's see. Perhaps the elk has run its course. Yeah, the fawn is better. Usually. Usually, uh In fact we actually have fawn put in there, so maybe I'll just chuck a fawn in. And take out somebody else who's not pulling their weight. I honestly haven't been getting much out of the sentry drone. Yeah. Poor sentry drone. I mean you are largely free, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, get the ovals. Get the ovals, Mori! The bots haven't gotten much better, but you battled all of my workers, and you actually won? Give me that dick again. Wow. You beat them with that? Alright. Maybe there are some synergies that I missed. Let's go then. Oh god. You see those conveyor belts? Just like my factory. At the very least, they ought to test your lane positioning. Oh, Jeebus. Okay, that's gonna be fun! Okay, and sick drone, that's a flyer, conduit, meat bot. Not really that much to say. Oh, I guess we better get him on the uh, far. Ow. See how that works? Okay, your turn. Cool. Um, yeah. So let's see. I could put down a skeleton to kill this and probably should. Yeah. And I could also kill this and probably should. I'd say go for killing the um yeah. Be good. Are we at least getting like a shit ton of bones off yep. of this? Not that it matters too much anymore. Because now we've got the meat bot. So... Wait, now I own the meat bot? Now you own the meat bot! I guess I do. What are you, Melter? When it perishes, the creature inside is released. You could also put Mama Bomb down. That would be good for clearing the field, but I don't really need to do that right now. Oh, I don't have any energy for it. Damn it, now he's gonna get it. Oh no, he well. Yeah, shit. We didn't play that well. Well. I think it might be time for a clearing. Yeah, screw it. Goodbye, everybody. Meat bot. Right. It's on its own. This isn't gonna do much. We can just wait. God damn. So if you put him down now, he's gonna kill both of those on the side before yeah. And then Nice. Yeah. And you're gonna have Bolt Hounds coming down. <gasps> Plasma Jimmy. I reckon. Things will be coming down this side, we want to put you yeah, here. Yeah, I think so. And 
he's gonna die now, but that's unfortunate. Like, hey. Plasma Jimmy can kill the thing opposite him. Yeah, but then Plasma yeah. Jimmy dies. Yeah. Instead, I think this conduit thing's just gonna have to be a a meat puppet. Yeah. Oh shit, that isn't going to work, is it? Vault no. Town will always block. I may have fucked it up. Alright, here we go. Can we do it twice? It's the big thing? Yeah. Yes. Kill Bolton. No, okay, I can only go on creatures. Um. Let's see. You can sacrifice the explode bots, can't you? I can. Uh, but they'll be adjacent to other explode yeah. bots right now. Let's just get this explode bot, huh? Oh, you could use it to kill that dude. Or I could just get me a fawn. Oh, good. You're treading water. Yep. Mostly. Uh-oh. Now he's got the jimmy. We don't know how much power he has. That's true. Presumably the same amount as mine. Yep. Uh-oh. Now he has my elk. Yep. Well, I could just put a power yeah. buff conduit, I guess. A buff conduit, just to... Yeah. Cool. Skeleton to keep you from it being attacked. Yes, so... Because it looks like he's out of... Um... He's just going to keep getting mine, though. Shit. I think I have gotten myself into a bad situation. I think it's time to explode, everyone. And now you should be able to just kill things. This is true. Yeah. I'd say don't play that. Whip the skeleton style yeah. the hand in the, um... And now... Yeah, you can uh, pop the dead hand into the, um... Well, I'd lose the fallen. Yeah, true. But, uh... Might be worth it. <laughs> what? Only one? One card left, I guess. Crap. Oh, scanner's online. Which card to scan? Just kidding. Obviously the one with the best stats. Fuck. The stat line could be better. Uh-oh. Your move. Well, that's a problem. You're out of cards. Starvation sits in. Uh, I guess there is a, um... Yeah. Well, this isn't going great. No, it's not. I think we just died. We just lost. Fuck. Let's try that again. You open the crates around the temple, right? You need better cards. Hmm. Hmm. Well, maybe just a bit of strategy, honestly. Yeah. Though, I think those conduit bots are going to be, like, completely fucky, especially for this yeah. fight. So let's get rid of them. Buff Conduit, get out of here. Yep. Um, instead, we're going to want... Who do we want for this specific challenge? Um, I mean, honestly, I think the Elk coming back in is going to be good. Yeah, I think that one. And maybe somebody who jumps around to defend? Oh, yeah. Oh. Like the Mole Man. Like the Mole Man, yeah, but like... I don't we know. We probably don't need more... I mean, just... Okay, it's only one, so... Remember, there's no penalty for loss anymore. Yeah. Interestingly, the um, person I saw set and put him in the first spot and just have him start. Oh, 
you want to put something so he can't go in that last spot because then he'll start going back the other way. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Damn it. Goes anyway. Yeah. And now the elk is his. Yes. We've only got one sacrifice. We're free blood. Oh. Yep, oh, yep, yeah, you're fine. We. Yeah, we as well is right. Time for exploding, everyone. Right, so. Yeah, it goes the explosion. Oh, and then we lose. Damn it! Huh? Okay, we're gonna have to try that again. Ugh, you son of a bitch. The spider's still replying pretty much right away to that, um, to that person. I don't think they stayed for the answer. Oh well. Yeah. Oh well, we tried. This guy could be good. If I activate him here yeah. and get a high one and then activate him to try and get a low one later. Yeah. Okay, so I could kill that conduit. That's not worth it. I guess. I guess I will be getting him soon enough, huh? Yeah. Damn it. That is the downside is that he gets the horn. So, yeah. let's see. So, what we can do is. We've got three now, so we can either explode everything or we can bring the gamble bot online. I think now that the form's done sort of its job, I guess we take it over here. The fault trigger goes off. Unfortunately, that one's ready to jump ahead and just Except like. Except you've still got a bomb. Oh, I've still got a bomb. Yep. Nice to know. And there we go. Problem solved. Alright, so we can put hit this guy here. Gamble. Free. Not bad. Nice. I mean, if you want to, you could, but. Don't really feel the need though, not yet. Yeah. Let's see, now I can put the Alk in. Yeah, you can. Yeah, I'm gonna kill damage. Yeah. The elk is about to die, sadly. Uh, we should try and gamble for a worse. Yeah. Yes. One. Perfect. One's good. One yeah. I can live with. Do we want to put the sarcophagus down? Um, he's going to have a bit of time working for me, isn't he? Yep, yeah, because if you put him down now, the hound won't jump in front of him. And the explode bot is going to go off against the elk, so... Yeah. Yeah. This is probably for the best. If I put this guy here, it's probably useful, right? Uh, mm. Can we, like, mm. kill, kill... Oh, no, because then we'll kill the elk. The elk's well, dying yeah, one yeah, way or the other, isn't he? The elk's dying one way or another. You could get more damage through if you did that, so... Yeah. Oh, I don't have enough energy. Wait, I don't have enough energy? Oh, because he's rolled. six. Yeah. Yeah, we rolled. Oh, you just killed it. Okay, yeah. whatever. Fine. So oh, can... you could jump him, jump the bone in front of him right on the um, on the first slot, and then bolt hunt. You're right. Will just become yours the next but rotation. First, what I think I'll do is this, and then that. Yeah. There we go. Show me my biggest, unfortunately, it's this guy. Yeah. 
Okay. Okay, so we could just put this down, kill one of them. Yeah. I think that's what's likely to work. Good. Good. Yeah. All well and good. And that leaves me with a free one. Oh. Okay. Um. Sweet. We should probably pop down one of these guys, huh? Yeah, and get him doing his thing for a wee bit. Oh. Overkill damage, perfect. Very close. And then we can just... Pop off the mummy. Yep, I think we need to pop off the mummy. Good old Plasma Jimmy. Yeah, Plasma Jimmy. Hey, hey. Hey. Yeah. Um, let's pop down a skeleton. Skeleton! Oh, look at that! A bunch of excess damage to an arrogant computer. We always like that. The necromancer raises the corpse. Doesn't matter. Yep. Nice luck you had. I guess playing a perfect game is no match for good RNG. It's true. <laughs> hey, look, the Game Boy is online. Pompous Automaton. I guess you won. Your ambition is to become the scribe of the dead? That naive spinster. You ought to reconsider. And another plasma jimmy. I mean, plasma jimmy's pickle. Oh, entry so you can get the thing. Nope, no. another gamble bot though. <laughs> Daniel knows what he likes. Well, let's put those in the deck, huh? Plasma Jimmy, in you go. Gamble Bot. Um, He's on the next page, bottom left. Yeah. There you go. Who's been failing us lately? Um, I mean, Dead Hand hasn't been doing what he... I guess these don't need yeah. to be here anymore. We had them for a specific purpose, and that purpose is over. Huh, did I always have the scanner on me? Oh, that's the monocle. Yeah, we don't. We can, I suppose we could try and buy a booster pack to see if we can get the. It is time, challenger. Choose the scribe that you will replace. Yes. Okay. Um, I've changed my mind. I'm gonna replace Bot Boy. Yeah. He gave you gambling. We all know. Ooh, Moon works. time. <laughs> Suckers. Oh, you actually picked me. Great. I can skip past the part where they whine at me. Let's get this over with. I've got some big plays to make. You're supposed to battle the scribe that you picked, but like a powered up version for the finale, this is going to be different. Oh, we're fighting the moon again. Oh yeah, okay. it's just a background. Put down the fawn. I'll just leave this here. I've got to give it to that dredger. Not as useless as I thought. Oh, it's that card, whatever the fuck. It yeah, that. Uh... Yeah. I don't think we want to know, but I think it's about to die. Or, um... Well, let's find out. 97? Yeah, I figured something like that. That's the ticket. <laughs> Corrupted Chunk! Ooh, look at him go! We got a freaking model now. Yeah, I think we did. And oh, who could have guessed that something crazy would happen? Creating new save file, there was also something else on this video. I want some power. Something else. There were a whole bunch of messages in there that I couldn't see. Uh, I think we are the robot now. It's just me to see a little blood stain there. Or oil stained? No, I get the feeling it's blood. You know, after the cold cream. You done gawking? No. We can start. Good. This is Botopia, a once great technological paradise. It's rolled over by four, uh, uberbots. That's right. 
and you've got to get out there and beat them. Why? Well, to perform the great transcendence, of course. Doesn't matter what that means. You want it, okay? Can we stand up? It looks like the... Huh. Because this looks like the, um, the cabinet. Yeah. Guess this is our starter deck. Yeah. Sniper, you may choose what, uh, which opposing space a card bearing the Citral Strikes. Ooh, nice. Nice. And Double Gunner, we remember him. Uh, energy bar, I assume, gives you energy. Battery bearer. Yeah. Provides an energy. And shield bar, I'm best in his... First time it's bearing, a uh, card bearing the Citral will take damage. Prevent nice. that damage. Okay. Oh. Get up. No. We've got transcending to do. Oh. Oh. Well, let's try and transcend then. Botopia used to be safe for travelers. Now rogue bots block all the major roads. Error. You're not used to seeing five lanes, are you? Unless you can never pull that off. Alright, well, uh, empty vessel. What do you do? Can I not read you, buddy? Zero two. But energy bot. Yeah. No, you don't have the energy. Oh, you're a twofer. Gotcha. Well, I don't really need to put down... Oh, wait. There is something. 49er. He's going to head down, and then he's going to head to the left. Yeah. Oh, great. Explode bots. Oh. Well. <laughs> Making them explode against other people. What am I even picking out of here? I don't know. I think that one's your, like, empty vessels versus your, um... Okay. Energy bot. Well, energy bot will give me an energy. You've currently got two that are going to be down, so... There we go. And then we can do shield bot or sniper bot. Well, I sure would like to snipe some things. Can't, because you've only got one left this turn. Oh. Yeah. I guess it's establishing a board presence time, huh? Yep. Okay. Yeah, empty vessels, as I thought. We're at four. I think the sniper bot's going to be important. Put it, if you put it there, then you can explode the explode bot. Explode bar. the explode bot, yes. Yeah. Um, or the that's minor bot first. I need to get rid of two spots. No, 49er is... Fine, I'm gonna oh, need to sacrifice use, them. Use the double gun. Can we afford the double gunner? Oh, wait, I can just put the empty vessel there. Now we've got three, yeah. Now, how do we. Okay, so let's give us the empty vessel. Alright, we're getting close to double gunner. Leap bot, insect drone. Damn, we are like perilously. I'd say if we go for, um... I think shield bot needs to stay here. Yeah. And you need to take out 49er. Um, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, um... My energy bot is kind of taking up spot, isn't it? Yep. It would otherwise be better for my double gunner. Yeah. And then empty vessels and all of them. And then we can just boop. Yay! Mm. Empty vessels. Overkill time! Nice. It's weird that the it's best defense you. over bots. You carry a spark that can uh, reactivate old bots. Add them to your deck, you know. Then they fight for you. Forty nine er energy bot, alarm bot, sister. Shit. Well, well to see. Okay, so that's where we came from. I guess this is where we're going. I guess this is where we're going. You'll need more than a few reactivated bots. That is, if you wish, truly wish to the, enact the Great Transcendence. Botopia has some of the most OP items just lying around. 
That will recharge your energy one turn. Pretty good. If you're smart, you'll use your items liberally. You'll replenish them at a waypoint, obviously. Okay. Bite sounds. Ooh, dynamite. Broken, Broken bot. bots. Chilled bot. Well, let's put down an empty vessel, huh? Sort of block ourselves from damage. Explode bot, shield bot. Well, we got a broken bot right there. Right now, we put down an energy bot. It's like grab a sniper bot going on. Um, oh, we can't. Uh, yeah, double gunner, I was going to say, so that one doesn't matter too much. We can use the energy bot. Pop him, what, in front of Explode Bot? Yeah, I think so. I'm not even quite sure what he does. He can use one more. Yeah, that turn. Hey, what? Right. Ow. Uh, Sniper Bot might be best in front of the broken one. Cause then Again, we have to decide whether we're drawing or empty vesseling. Um, I think empty vesseling. Yeah, probably. We got four. Yeah. It's not going to do much. I wonder what alarm bot does. I want to read this. Creature posing this card gains a power. What? Why? Ugh. Well, okay. Drawback for an undercasted card, I guess. Anyway, we're at four right now. Sniper bot can take out shield bot. We won't die. One, two, three. We take three. We don't want. We would to die. The um, we don't. The ex the thing in me bought the sniper, uh, not the sniper, the double one in front of the uh broken bot because the explode bot when that goes to the double gunner will explode that which will then explode the gun a double gunner. Just as a note. So at okay. the moment, I think we want. Anyway, empty vessel. Time. Yeah, I think there, and... And we're going to put the sniper, sniper bot, bot in front of here. Uh, that, yeah, okay, sure, and kill a shield bot, I think. That's never going to die now, yeah. is it? That, that's okay. So I'd say with the shield bot, um... Yeah, yeah kill, kill the shield bot. Yeah. I was actually going to say, um... <laughs> you could have done that, but you killed two things for one. Okay, alarm bot, sure go there for now. He's not opposing anyone now. Don't put him there, he'll get the shield bit, but will get more powerful. Um, don't want to take out the explode bot. Not at the moment, no. Just shoot that shield bot. Because the secret is, when that, um... Okay. Wait, there's no good to put this guy now. The dual striker? Yeah. Yeah, uh, so what I'm saying is currently put an empty vessel in front of the explode bot on the right. Why? Because what, when the um, sniper bot's turn comes around, hit the explode bot. Well, uh -huh. it, basically you should have hit the explode bot next turn and it would have also blown up the shield bot on the um, right. Right, well if I blow that up it'll take these out, right? Yes. So what's the point of having something there? It'll just get destroyed. Mm, mm. So well, don't put an empty vessel there. I'm assuming that's not what you want to do this turn. Um, I might as well, actually. Yeah, I think you might want to take that shield a bot down. This one? No, not that one. The one in front of you. Yep. That one? That one. That's just going to go when I take the broken bot. I can take two bots out with one stone. Okay, if you want to do that and get rid of the sniper bot as well. It's not great, but uh, otherwise they're just hitting me every turn, aren't they? Because, mm -hmm. yeah, as I say, what I wanted you to do last turn was hit that explode bot, which would have killed the shield bot alongside it. Alright. Now we can put down the gun double gunner. Yeah. Yeah, we're good. We didn't put an empty vessel yeah, down. Not and, enough oh, energy. Okay. Okay, you win. I can see. Let's move on. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna get better than just 
that are low victory points. Nah, oh, man. Fuck this guy. He's gonna whine about things being optimal. Sniper bot, nice to see. Gift bot. Without bearing the signal perishes, a random card is created in your hand. Useful. Ooh, or a double gunner. Another double gunner. Gift bot is cheap though, which is nice. We don't have many cheap cards at the moment. Yeah. Cheap gift bot's probably the best. Yeah. I mean sniper bot's really good. He is. He's Real best way to fight back those rogue bots? Modify yours, give them OP abilities. <laughs> It's sacrifice time! Choose a card from your deck. We could put the double gunner thing on something way cheaper. Let's see. Oh, this is to give something else on it. Oh, to add it! Uh, what is this? Sniper. Holy oh, shit, that's really good. Yeah. What else can we get? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, so satisfied. Down. Okay, that's cool. You're almost at the waypoint. Don't choke now. Oh no! Who could have guessed there was going to be a fight in there? A bridge. A bomb. Oh, you can put the empty pistol in front of it. It'll just die though. Oh yeah, because that thing's got two. I do I draw a real card? Oh right, yeah, can't draw on your first turn. It's about to say you can put it down later. Well, I mean, we can just do that now, right? Yeah. So we could also do that with energy bot. Yeah. That was worth it. Totally worth it. Let's see, sniper bot. Well, that's what we're going to be doing this turn, isn't it? This gift bot again. But well, we got sniper bot energy now. Yeah. Uh, you might want to put him, yeah, so it doesn't die. Oh. Yeah, you got an editor. Can't go into the back lines despite being a sniper. Oh well. Sadly, no. Let's see, this turn, not sure. No. Well, we could always put down a long bot and just like wreck this guy, huh? Yeah. It's hilarious. What the hell are you? I don't know, but I don't like swap it. Swap bot. A card being signals dealt damage, swap its power and health. Gotcha. Oh. Perfect. Perfect. Because the um, alarm bot's going to hit it, Got and you. then you're going to snipe it. I mean, it's going to get killed before it gets to hit it. You know that's how that works, right? Oh, uh, sorry, I was thinking, um, if it includes a strike here. No, that's annoying. Uh, that said, we could just put down Double Gunner right now. Could just Keep take up. down Alarm Bot and then yeah. put down Double Gunner. It's a pretty... Because we have to choose now. Yeah, yeah no. We're... Oh, right. Shit. Well... Yeah. Oh, never mind, I won anyway! You made it to the first waypoint. Cool. It's a beacon! Your items are recharged. Boss that you've destroyed in this area will stay that way. And if and when you do perish, you'll be brought back here. It's an elegant system. That's my deck, I guess. I was gonna say, can you click on the um, thing we bought? Cash? Glorious commerce. Your robots are accepted here. Cards. Oh. Upgrades. Whatever that is. Six. Oh, you've only got 11. Ooh, immediately bought. Pick one of your cards. Let's go for gift bot. Get a cheap yeah. one in, right? Yeah. Recalibrate. Um, double strike, not really useful. What's this one? Uh, I guess Battery bearer. 
Nice. I think I'll do that. Good. Go. Hmm. Kids, you're left. That's you did. Oh. You bought sniper bot bolt hound. I'm taking sniper bot. This would be useful. Yeah. Money. Go. Cool. An NPC. Woof. Sorry. Turn back. The bridge is totally busted. Go back. I'll need time. Beat a boss? That should give me enough time. Yeah, so down one and then... Like Wait, that. where's it come yeah. from? You haven't checked down? Oh. We got ourselves a pelt. Nice. I wonder... Oh. Hmm. Wish we knew what those were, but I guess we have to buy them to find out. Okay, over this bridge. Eastern Bartopia. How much of value out that way? But you've still got to explore here. You know, for the Great Transcendence. Oh, yeah, there was a... Interesting. Well, let's go and have a look. Is there one down? No. no. Is there one down? Because it looks like there should be, and it's just being secretive about it. A me -bot. bot. Oh, but I could take another double gunner. Those are pretty useful. They're not great to have a bunch in your hand, but they are super fun. I guess I'll take a me bot, because I do yeah. like that random shit. Yep. Money! Two whole gold. I guess we're fighting. Nice. I feel like there should be more downs there. They feel like there should be downs. Yeah. Well, let's put an empty vessel in front of that explode bot, huh? Yeah. A real card. Yeah. Feel bot. Me bot. Cool. He's jumping around. He being a jumpy boy today. Let's see. I could uh, sniper out that automaton. Oh, no way. I can't get rid of that automaton. No. But I could take out the explode bot. Yep. And he will take out the broken robot as well. So another way you could do it is you could put the alarm bot in front of the broken bot. Then you'd attack the broken bot, destroy it, and that would take out both that and the exploder. I guess so. It'd be pretty funny. <laughs> you know, not the best. Shield though. latcher, whatever the hell that is. Shield latch for copy and signal Paris' owner chooses a creature to gain the nano armor sigil. Nice. Cool. Um anyway, we're drawing from here. Double gunner, oh good double gunner who Okay, we got five anywhere. right now. You could leave him in the corner and just like so, we can't get the double gunner yet. Yeah. Uh, I reckon here. shield latcher. And how much is sniper? Put you in front here. Sniper is available. Yeah. Let's see. Just kill you, huh? Yeah. Why not? Oh, oh this one. Yeah. Nano armor, please. Thank you. Now you can get okay, your double gunner. We really gotta kill these guys though. Yeah, you've got double gunner who can now do that. He can wait. Oh yeah, he can. Cool then. Um I guess I'll take one of these. And maybe a MTPS. Um oh you can't actually kill them both. Well start with the 49 eh? and get he he has to shoot. There we go. And um, now you can also Okay, cool. Yep. Sniper Another bot. sniper bot. Sounds useful. Sniper bot and a shield bot? Why not? Yeah. And you can kill the swap bot, it turns out. I find it interesting that despite the fact that it should only be doing 4 damage, it seems to be killing them with their 5 health. 
I concede. Happy? Sip surrender? No thanks. Uh, Guardian. Yep. Just put some spots. <laughs> some money. Are you wondering about that star? You've been winning a lot. Now you've got a bounty on your head. <laughs> it's sure to attract bounty hunters. It recess when you die, though. Let's go uh, down. Like, I'm absolutely convinced that those should have... We'd already been here. It, well, you didn't try all of the ones that could have had a um, thing in the middle. What? So, uh, go back one, go down one. Okay, I'm going down try one. That one. Go now try here. that one. Down the bottom. Between there, so yeah, that's there's no arrow there. You see these yeah. arrows? They're well, the ones. Well, you saw we the got here in the got. first place by finding out that there was a hidden one. Remember? There was no hidden one, dude. Yeah, there was. There was not. Yes. Draw a card from your empty vessel pile. Okay, seems pretty useful. Better than a shield bot. Well, century mm. drone is nice and cheap. It is nice and cheap. That's true. Maybe we'll take a century drone. Yeah. Nice and cheap. But I swear, okay. There okay. was not. There was not. There, I don't know what to tell. It's got the stank! Okay, alarm bot. Free, <gasps> Put it in front of the amoeba. Free one. Put it in front of the amoeba. Uh, oh, can't no. do that yet. Yeah. So it's gonna be empty vessel. Okay, so it doesn't really matter what we draw because we have guys. But if you put a me bot in front of there, it will take down its power, it will kill it, and then yep. I think I don't think it gets to keep its extra power though. No, Sad. it does not. Oh, well. Okay, so this turns a sniper bot turn. So we can just draw what we want. Sniper bot. Guess what? You're gonna be shooting the yeah, explode so bot. Put it there, yep, yeah, put it there. Yeah. And that guy can't hit either of you dudes, but now you can hit him. Yes. Let's see, five. We could put down both. Yeah. That'd be kind of a waste. You could put a shield bot in there. Just Probably could just put down a long bot for damage, huh? Yeah, it's true. Satisfying. Gear Moonberg? The name's Gear Moonberg. And I'll be taking that scalp of yours. Nothing personnel, kid. Okay. You were unexpected, huh? Yeah, well, when, you, when your guys die, you'll be able to get some fun stuff. This guy's going. a shover. I think it's just a case of attack with everything at the moment. Bye bye. All right. Waypoint. Items one hundred percent charged. Bot spawn is one hundred percent offline. Lame. Power is dead on this old thing. I'll let you get up if you can go get a new battery. You're allowed in the inspection room only. Just give me the battery from the inspectometer and come back. <laughs> Unimpressed. Okay, we oh, want a... Alarm and sniper 1-1. One, one. Interesting. Oh, I left those things turned off? That's fine. Just solve some easy puzzles. Okay. Uh, let us go and save our... Well, we saved 45 seconds ago, so yeah. now's a good time to end the stream. We got all the way through Act 2 in that stream. And I guess we'll good. find a new uh, portrait somewhere, maybe. 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 We'll see you guys later.